Sorry. I hope I didn't like scare anyone. Ooh, Jason. Tell me what you're chasing. Cause tonight. Uh, they'll never give you what they want. Or something like that. Keep on running. Keep on running. Alright, I am here. Sorry, I am. I, I am so. You made it? Oh, what's up, Miggy? Oh, what's up? How you doing? Welcome to Stream Arena. Welcome to, to making it the stream. Welcome. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Let me see if I can make myself. Oh god. Just, just a tiny bit bigger. I accidentally messed with my options a little bit before, so it's it's pretty weird. The song is pretty good, not gonna lie. Dude, it's so good! I started listening to it from a... There's a streamer called Xeno who does Final Fantasy XIV stuff. And uh... The, his chat kind of memes about that sometimes, the song. So I'm like... Randomly, I'll just be chilling and I'll just be like, Jason, tell me what you're chasing. Cause night will never give you what you want. I wish I could play it on stream, but I think it might be copyrighted, so we probably don't want to do that. Actually, I don't know if it's copyrighted or not, if, if some Twitch streamers play it, but. Welcome to stream, welcome. How are you guys doing? Hello and hello, my little Miki. How are you? How have you been, Miki? What, what, are you, what are you usually doing? How how you miss stream? How you miss stream so much? What are you doing that's so important? What the hell? I got myself a uh, Dr. Pepper cream soda. I took my uh, I took my allergy meds because I was dying. Calling the copyright police right now. Banned and blocked. All of the above reported. Never gonna recover. <laughs> Rude. Dude, I cannot wait to start playing Armored Core. Like, I can't wait to start playing Armored Core. But I want to finish Prey first. Or else it's going to be another game that I start and never finish. That's usually what happens whenever like uh, I stream games. Usually whenever I stream games, it's either they get finished or... 90% of the time, they probably never get finished, so. <laughs> so. You got a whole life. A whole life? I would wish I could say the same. I don't really do much. Like, work. I barely even do that. But then, like, after that, what what am I doing? Playing video games? So, listen, the whole reason I was a little bit late to stream today was because I was playing video games. I was finishing up playing EDF with Night, so. Well, it wasn't that late, okay? It was only like five minutes late. <clears throat> I like playing video games. And whenever EDF 6 comes out, you bet I'm streaming that. So I won't be late to stream because then I'll be actually playing the game, so. What is our objective? What the heck do we need to do? Where did I leave off at yesterday? We did like three side stuff. We're not doing December. Uh, deep storage, uh, crew quarters, deep storage and crew quarters before we do the main story. So where is deep storage at? Okay, well we can't do that. And then where is crew? Uh, crew quarters. Okay, they're both in the Arboretum. Okay. Well, I guess we're going to the Arboretum. You hate video games. You always start them and play for two hours and move on to the next game. What the heck? Listen, I love video games, dude. If you give me a game that I can grind in, I will grind that game forever. Like, I friggin' love... Well, I guess I, I've stopped playing Final Fantasy XIV for a while now, but I love roguelikes. So much. Well, hello, Cookie. What up, Sammy? Welcome back to the stream. How are you doing? Welcome, welcome. There's a scientifically pioneered ecologies. Well, boom. Everything is scared the crap out of me. <clears throat> you have ADHD. That's valid. I'm like, uh, I don't know. I don't know how to explain. I probably don't have ADHD. But I have a thing where, like, I always have to be multitasking. I always have to be multitasking. 
Am I watching a video? Have to be playing a game while doing it. Am I... Am I, like, uh, editing a video? I have to be watching a video while I edit a video. This makes no sense. The only thing where I probably don't multitask in is if I'm singing and recording something. Because that actually needs, like, full attention, right? How was hanging out with your friends yesterday, by the way, Sammy? I hope it went well. I hope everything went swimmingly. Why, why do people say that? Why do people say swimmingly? Who even, who even started saying that? Mood is definitely mood. It's just, I don't know if it's like an attention thing for me. It's probably more along the lines of, uh, I feel like I need to be doing something productive. All the time. Even if like, playing a game isn't really productive while watching a video. <laughs> I, I really like the looking glass in this game. It's so cool. Like, look at this. It's a whole... It's a whole aquarium, right? It's amazing. But then you destroy it. And it's actually just glass. This is such a cool thing in, in a game that I just don't really see. I wonder if it's like a 3D space rendered here. Just inside the glass. I don't know why this... I don't know why, like, looking glass in this game, which is what they call it, intrigues me so much. It was a disaster at first, but it went well at the end. What? How, how was it a disaster? Hanging out with friends was a disaster. Oh, no. The shader? That would make sense. Silence pistol. Shadra. Same. If we can actually, I think there was a guy all the way in the back up here. If we can scan one more dude. Hello, are you here for an appointment? Spider game did it too with the buildings. Oh, so that's how like they got the interior to look like it was probably full, right? Oh, if we can scan this guy, we can get the new ability. Psycho shock. There we go. Oh, wait, actually, we need one more? What? Why do we need one more? I thought we already had two. Please. Okay. Why? Why is the... Does, is that robotic voice getting scarier and scarier, or is it just me? That's... That's weird. Like, the... The... The helmet. I feel like the helmet is... Getting sus. The voice that's like, psych psychic aptitude available. I feel like it used to not sound so demonic as it does. Um, this is cool. Psycho Shock is cool. But we want something. Freeze humans from Typhon Mind Control. That's what we want. Um. We want that. Um, so we're going to use Psycho Shock. And then Psycho Shock probably on the telepathy guy, and then we're gonna try and free the mind control dudes. The nightmare's hunting me. Oh shoot, where is he at? Where? Uh, wrong button. This is the right button. Listen, nightmare. Uh, I don't want to deal with you right now. Um, how do I use this? Is this in here? I think. Uh, crap. How, how do I use the thing to make it go away? Was it- it was an audio log, right? Maybe it was this. Oh, I don't think it's working. Oh god. I don't think the nightmare is going away, chat. Nightmare says me angry. Yep. Yeah. Maybe I have to not be seen by him. To make him go away. I think he lost me. Let me see if I can play it. Oh, that one's attract. Did I play the attract nightmare? <laughs> I hope I didn't play the attract one. Okay, there you go. It does make you go away. Oh, I got an achievement for it too. You rang? Use the one to attract the nightmare, not repel it. God dang it. Mod, mood, mod. Maybe it's what they did with the Maybe floor to ceiling window with Morgan's apartment. Oh, true. That would make sense too. And we spent a lot of our money on arcades, which left us broke. That's valid. Uh, 
All right. Um, we don't. We still don't even have a password for this, so we can't even get inside unless. Maybe let's let's go to the top. See if we can get up top, and then maybe there's a way to break in through the. Shit. Okay, that's not gonna work. Maybe I can help you. It uh, bounces off the building. I don't think it's gonna work. Wait, why does that one stick? Wait, why do these stick but not the other ones? Why didn't it stick there? Is it like a little bit wet or something? What? I don't understand, but sure. It looks like the side of the building might be a little bit wet, but I can't tell to be honest. Oh shoot. Glue doesn't stick to glass, remember? Then why is it sticking here? That's so weird. Let's, let's see if we can navigate this. Hello, cat. Ah, uh, why do I keep slipping off of this one? Maybe we can do something different. Ooh, Jason. Tell me what you're chasing. You know, we'll get there eventually. Maybe I can help you. Oh, shit. Okay, maybe, maybe we did too much of a good job. Oh, God, I'm gonna fall and die. <laughs> um. Okay, so what should I do first? Should I try and free the dudes from being uh, mind broken? The mind break tag? Free them from the mind break tag first. Yeah, that's what we should do. Oh fuck! <laughs> oh shit! Uh, <laughs> uh, well, I guess we're in the thick of it, huh? Hey, become free! Oh, they're all unconscious. Okay. Oh hey! Oh sh shoot! Oh god, it hurts! Everything hurt! Isn't there one more human? Or did he die? Or were there maybe only two humans, hu humans in here? Psycho shot! Screw you. Now, we use our secret tactic. Where are you going? Okay, dude. Oh, so they're just unconscious. Welcome. Okay. Maybe I can help you. The dude just left. He said screw that. Alright, well I guess we're in here then. Did he come back? Or are you just chilling? He's just being chilling. Come here. Hey! I have a bone to pick with you. Hello. Good to see you again, Dr. Yu. Come down here, you coward! Face my shotgun! Oh my god. He is a coward, Chad? What the heck? Come face me. Can we glue him? Oh my god, we can. Oh, that was so much damage! That's what you get. Oh, shoot, our power's on cooldown. Hold on. We need to repair our suit, too. Oh god. Yeah, where'd your powers go now? Hey, hey, stop running. Um, let's just glue him. Why are you running? Come back here. That was pretty fun. So, the enemies in this game really know when to run, huh? Wasn't it like something to do with the Typhons and uh... Hello. Good to see you again, Dr. Yu. Hi. I'm doing things for survival, so I guess it makes sense that they always just like take off running. 
We lock the doors to the greenhouse, but this one flies. Wait, what? Oh, the, the tele, tele, telepath one. We don't have long before it figures out the roof isn't covered. <laughs> okay. Uh, five minutes ago, Edna tried making it into the greenhouse before it took her before it took her over. She won't stop screaming, yelling at us to stay back. If we can kill the floating thing that infected her, maybe we can save her. If you can find this note, if you find this note, please help kill it because we won't be ourselves. Well, we got them. We definitely saved them. Saved one of them at least. I don't. We saved two of them. Operator dispenser. Uh, well, we don't know what operator this is. That was pretty good. That was that went pretty well, if you ask me. Chipsets. What do we get? This is for our psycho, psycho thing, right? Psychoscope. That would be good to have. Uh, allows detection of hidden mimics. Boosts the amount of damage done by electrostatic burst. Reduces the initial psi cost of morph powers. Honestly. Uh, we should probably get, like, um, a Nero mod that increases how many we can put in our... Okay, we need three Nero mods for that, though. Excuse me. Look at all these tomatoes. This is great. We can eat all of these or we can, like, uh, sacrifice them to the fabricator. Or the recycler. Excuse me. Wow, who's this guy? Oh shoot, this guy's messed up. So much for that guy. Water pressure regulators? Do I need them for something or are those just uh, stuff? Rip Ronnie, right? Rip Ronnie, dude. I can't believe the forehand, forearm handed girl died. Poor Ronnie. Ronnie is a witch. Alright, well, there's that, I guess. Hello. Good to see you again, Dr. Yu. Hi. Um, so where do we need to go? Alex is safe. Oh, is this where Alex is, dude? That's, that's crazy. Okay. Crazy ambience. Chill. Um, deep storage. Or like, uh, habitation pod. The habitation pod... Uh, we haven't seen like a security place yet, have we? What was here? Was that a security place? Because I want to see if we can get a, a map. Oh, that's a loading bay. I think that's it. Is it? Or did we, did we check up here? I thought we did. We were like crouching around somewhere. This definitely isn't going to be anything. What's this? There's a mimic in there, that's right. Um, it doesn't look like there's anything up top here, but... We can try to climb up, maybe? And then maybe we can shoot a hunter bolt, a huntress bolt in. Okay, well that didn't go through. Maybe the Huntress will go through, though? Um, I don't think it's actually anything is going through this, huh? No, it's an invisible wall! What, what am I supposed to do about that, then? This is, like, first the first uh, area that I you actually can't get into. Can I fall through? Like, it's an invisible wall, but can I fall through it? Maybe the fuel wind mall, but uh, wall, but still. Uh, ch -ch -ch -ch. Can I like do anything? Okay, well, I can't hit it through the thing. I'm already expecting to not be able to mimic, but I still want to give it a shot. If there's anything to mimic. Yeah, I feel like it's not going to let us go through anyways, but... What is this? Formula testing approved. Entry 165. I've managed to reduce the growth time to around 10 minutes per fruit. It's remarkable to see them sprout from practically nothing. What are you doing, cat? Cat got the zoomies. Nothing and grow to an edible size and ripeness before my very eyes. More importantly, I finally obtained clearance for a wider range of... 
wider range testing of the growth formula from Dr. Kelstrup. All that's left is actually fabricating it, and then inserting it into the sprinkler system. I'm keeping the fabrication plan on my person as I have no doubt others would love to claim credit for it. Julian Howard... Wait, so what is this? Something to grow faster? Growth formula fabricator on Julian Howard. Okay. So what we probably want to get is the formula from Julia Howard, uh, put it in the fertilizer dispenser, press the button, and then something weird's gonna happen, right? That's what I would assume at least. Is there any small items around here? If there's a small item around here, then we'll, I'll, I'll try to use it. But if there's not, then I'll save it for later. Which is what it's looking like. Okay. Well, we gotta come back here anyways later, so... Um... We should also try and find a security... Security area. I'm also running low on ammo and stuff, so I'm gonna go fabricate some. <clears throat> I think that's a good idea. Fabricate some stuffs. Oh, Jason. Tell me what you're chasing. Regulates flow of water supply. Plumbing systems? Was there like a... Is there a quest for this? <clears throat> we need one more Nero mod so we can make... Oh, shoot. Oh, they all take... Oh, God. No, no. We need metals, chat. We need metals. Jesus, I thought that was Nightmare coming. Do you think these are gonna be metal? What do you guys think? Maybe I can like, kinetic blast these ones? Okay, it doesn't- it doesn't put them close enough. I was gonna see if I can kinetic blast them to be in like, recycler charge range, but that didn't work, obviously. And hopefully most of these are... Oh, that is not worth it. That is not a lot at all. Okay, well, never mind on that plan. What is going on? We'll make uh, we'll make some shotgun ammo. What is happening? Is that? I made a shotgun. This is not what I meant to do. Oh my god. That was the probably the complete opposite of what I wanted to do. We can put these spare parts in here actually. We'll put the shotgun in, because that's not what I wanted to make. Um What how about the suit repair kits? Do they give much? They give that I don't have no clue what that is. Uh we picked up a lot of tomatoes, so it doesn't have a lot of material yield either. The fuel one makes the freaking shotgun instead of the shotgun shells. Ah, yada yada. Uh, what do we want to make? We just want to make shotgun ammo. So... Shotgun ammo, shotgun ammo. Shotgun shells. And then I'll make a Neuro mod. Dang, that uses so much materials. What is going on? Like, what? Is something crazy going on in guts now or something? Like, that's literally the only thing I can think of. And I really want to upgrade, like, uh... I want to upgrade the Q-beam and the shotgun, but they both require Nero mods to do that. Like, good Nero mods. A, a pretty good amount, I would say, right? Uh... Why did I want one more? It's because I wanted Psychotronics, didn't I? Okay. Well, we can do that, or we can get one more. 
be able to upgrade. Yeah, these use so much. It's a, a max of like 20 Neuromods if you want to be able to upgrade them a lot. That's like our damage. Or we can just, you know, keep going Psychotronics like we have been and just focus on damage for that. I think that'd be fine. Uh, let's see. Inventory. Scope ship sets. Let's add some of these. Um, you can put that in. Uh, morph powers. That's fine. We don't, we don't really want morph powers. Like, morph powers is fine, but I don't feel like they consume as much... Um, Psy to be worth getting, if that makes sense. But I definitely do want more Psychoscope stuff. Galagos Habitation Pod or Deep Storage. Um, let's go to Deep Storage first. I don't know if we're going to get any more quests that require us to go into the crew area, so... Maybe on the way to... Deep storage, we'll find something like that. I didn't make any glue, but I probably don't even have... to mimic there. But I probably don't even have enough to, to make it anyways. Only one mimic? It was two. Are, are they disguised as lily pads? Is that what's going on here? Hey, that one's a greater mimic. There's also a thermal dude back there, so that's scary. Yeah, the thermal guy is a lot more scarier than the mix, I'll tell you that much. You're thunking around. Thunk. Uh, let's see. We can nullify his psi abilities and then switch to a kinetic blast. I wonder if I can put these on um hot bars. I probably could. Mm. Yeah, let's nullify his abilities first. I think that would be the way to go. After we get a scan, then nullify. And then we'll kinetic blast him. What the? Maybe maybe he doesn't have psi abilities. He just flew. That dude just joint zipped. I tried to shoot him from really far away with that. Oh, shoot. Bonk! Bonk! Okay, he's dead. Okay. So far, I think we're doing pretty good this, this time around. I did also turn the difficulty down because Jesus, dude. Get hit once, it very hurt. <laughs> Uh, bridge, crew quarters, so we're going the complete opposite way. Deep storage is what we want to go to. Um, I'm wondering if the Galagos habitation pod is where the crew storage is. Wait a second. Wasn't there a... Wait, there's a weapons locker here? What? Wait, so what is this? This is the bridge. This is storage AR01, a weapons locker. Do we have a code? It seems like no. Uh, it doesn't look like we're getting in there. I don't think so, at least. You gotta go, bye, Googie. Have a good night, Sammy. No problem. Or night, I mean morning. Have a good morning. It's no problem. It's no problem. Have a good day. Dismantle this. And this should be the security point. Right, so... Download area map. You're so tired, the musicals finally ended? The musicals? What musicals? None. Uh, we want... Was it Julian Howard? Was that the girl? I think it was, right? Where is their body gonna be? Uh, level 3... Out here? Where even is that? Storage room. You don't have a card for that either. Oh god. Doesn't look like there's a way into the storage room either. It's all rocks. 
You were playing in the musicals? Oh, so you, you, you were like a theater stuff, right? I don't think we're getting in there. Oh god, where are we? I don't want to get stuck. I really don't want to get stuck. Okay, Julian Howard. I'm going to assume that going this way is not going to be it. But it does look like we can make the cross for fun here. Can we cross for fun here? It looks like it. Just use this to get over it. There we go. Um, We'll use our glue gun that we don't have a lot of ammo in. When we literally could have just went the other way and been fine. What is that? Oh, who is it? Who is that? Marietta. Thing is, it was so problematic since you were playing in Heather's. Oh, Heather's musical is pretty fun. Good afternoon, I think Heather's would be pretty fun. How's it problematic though? From 12 to 2 p.m. Jada's thing. Confirm. Dismantle all this stuff so we get so much, so much stuff. Okay. Uh, ba -ba 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 -ba. Sort. Please refer to the weekly upgrade for today's menu. Heather's is just so chaotic. Uh, it's probably probably a lot of work, huh? Did I? I thought your shift isn't for another two hours, but I need you to come in now. Is everything okay? No, it's not. Stop by my cabin first. Bring the gun from my safe. Yesterday's yeah. match was an abysmal failure. Piss poor root initiation. However, Dr. Lin from Psychotronics was kind of oh, provide me with a sample of material. Well, that should multiply the effectiveness of the phytohormones when applied to already mature I expect reduced time to maturity, increased yield, and an above normal salutary effect. Hopefully, it doesn't taste like shit. I just need permission to run the plan through the fabricator. I did not expect that. I really did not expect that. Well, that doesn't look good. Um, okay. So now we can fabricate that, which is good. But we have to fall all the way down here. It's... It's been so long since I've listened to anything from the Heathers, though, so I probably don't, don't remember a lot of the, uh... Songs, I guess? Only probably, like, the really popular ones that are still stuck in my head. Oh, there's, like, a... This is a looking glass, isn't it? Looking glass scene selection under construction. Thomas Tucker. Take ammo. Honestly, I should be just recycling all of these for extra parts. Oh, this is such a long way around. What is this? Just like, why is there a looking glass here just out in the middle of nowhere? It's like a little place you can walk. It's like hidden. Looking glass, relaxation area. Well, it's a very small relaxation area to be honest, but... Small and comfy. Tree, oh. Well, all this stuff looks really neat to be honest. Oh yeah, we got both of the things that were here. That's right, that wasn't actually glass, or that wasn't actually water, I forgot about that. That was actually glass. Okay, well... Uh, let's see if we can fabricate something. Um, fabricate the, the formula, the growth formula. I don't know if I'm gonna have, uh, enough to do it, but we can check. I might have enough because we just dismantled some uh some weapons and stuff, so we definitely could have enough to make the growth formula. At least I'd hope. I don't think we really collected that much junk, but I'll turn that stuff in. Dr. Howard's growth formula. Create. Oh, we had just enough material to make it. You know what I'm thinking is maybe I have to recycle the um I guess dismantling only gives you parts, so it doesn't give you, um... 
like uh minerals excuse me <laughs> okay i can't fit through trees we're too fat chat hello fat okay hello sprinkler controls oh boy this is gonna be fun wait i didn't even notice this was here should we should we check what this is first I need to go to... Oh, wait, what? Why? Wait, no, this is where we came up from, didn't, didn't we? The first time we came here. Oh, I'm so dumb. Alright, let's put in the sprinkler controls and see what this growth formula does. Search... Uh... Growth formula... Where is that? It should be one, right? This right here. Put that in. Uh... And then we press the button. And what bad... What what could possibly go wrong? Okay. Harvest your fruit after the growth cycle is complete. Um... <laughs> So I'm assuming these rooms could only get into from hacking them, right? At least that's what I assume. Well, I guess after the growth cycle is complete, so maybe we just come back here later? Because it doesn't seem like it's done yet. So, well, I guess we'll come back here later. It's just like making, you know, it's actually doing plant stuff. Okay. Spooky. Hello. I'm glad that at least we have the robots to talk to us when the game's all quiet and stuff. You know? We at least we have some type of friend here. Alright. Let's uh... What is this? Alex use office? Do not enter. Alex's grab shaft. I don't want to look at Alex's shaft. Thank you. Um... I'm assuming like we do have to... Do we have to go there? We don't have to. But let's go to deep storage first. <clears throat> I hope there's nothing bad down here. This kind of looks bad. Oh, his music's like hope. And airlock engaged. Transcribe Zachary West. Still not answering. What's wrong? Danielle tied the lock to her voice. We need her to speak the key phrase or we're not getting in here. Danielle. Would voice samples work? Transcribe recordings? Yes. If they have the right words. Or if we gathered enough to map her voice to a consonant and vowel list and started running patterns. I'll see if I can find her. Or her transcribe. I'll check her room first. All right, Ivy. Danielle. Look, don't do anything stupid. Okay? Ivy. Ivy. Shit. Damn it, Danielle, where are you? All right. Captain? It's unlikely Chief Show is still alive. I advise you follow Zachary West's strategy. Hack together voice samples. Your transcribe is equipped with the necessary software. Wait, really? Made my voice. I guess Danielle's that makes sense. Cabin might be a good place to get started. Okay. Captain? Did I? I thought your shift isn't for another two hours, but I need you to come in now. Is everything okay? No, it's not. What? This looks like a face. <laughs> Bro, it just looks like a square face. <laughs> what is this? Is it like, is this a room B2? Horden Baffles treasure map. Treasure map for Horden Baffle Flag Dasterus. <laughs> Horden Baffle Flag Dasterus. So this isn't probably in the game. This is probably a... This looks like a D&D &D or what What did they call it? Fort fortresses or something like that? This is, a, uh, this is a game map. This has to be, right? So this might not actually be in the game. But if it is in the game, that's going to be wild. I don't think I remember a, a room with three circles in it that looks like a face. Fatal Bring Fortress? Yeah. 
Transmitting the key code. Right away, Captain. Fatal Fortress. Horton Baffle Flag Dastrous. What a name, dude. Uh, why did I pause? I paused for a reason. No, I want to keep these. I want to keep these so I can throw them in the recycler. I don't think I get the parts. Unless they recycle them. I only get spare parts. I don't get the material. I only get spare parts if I uh, recycle. Okay. Well, what's in the bridge then? These don't seem to be like going to the next area very fast or anything like that, so... What is down here? Okay. Talos 1. So is this already unlocked? Why couldn't I just get here... Wait, no, this this goes to the bridge. That's right, okay. That was, I thought it was Talos 1 Lobby. Even though it clearly said bridge, but okay. Um, So yeah, we'll go to Alex Yu's place eventually just to loot. But I'm I'm good for now on looting it. <clears throat> Should we just trust January? I might just trust January, man. Screw December at this point. I'll I will go to Alex's place to loot to loot it, but Pomegranate. Oh man. <sighs> Stupid reference, okay, chat Hello. listen. Nice to see you. A shoddy. Shoddy, like a melody. A uh, shotgun shell fabrication plan. Russian blinis. Oh, blinis is pancake. Traditional Russian blinis. I know that from Mira. Dinner shifts begin at 7 p.m. I like how they have the whole entire uh, time thing in this, though. Okay, so why is this locked? Unlock? Okay. Well, I guess it's not locked anymore. Wait, so why was I able to unlock that? Did I have something for it? Just click on the button. Oh, yeah, just unlock it from the outside or lock it from the outside, I guess. Shawty, like a melody in my head, and I can't keep calm. Got me thinking like. Na 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 every day. And I found a song stuck on replay. Replay. Gonna be your melody. Oh, I can write you a symphony. Where the heck are we? I'm gonna save so we don't have to like go through that whole loading screen again. Use cigar. It's mine now. Psycho shock. Mm. Oh, actually, not I that we need. Mine. See you. Another puppet. Looking Ooh. for me with black your eyes. Come closer. Yes. A little closer. Was that a nightmare? Or did that guy just explode something? <laughs> Stupid puppets. You too? You want to come into a kitchen? Good. What the fuck? You sing, you insane. When will you stop? Stop! Can't think with all the puppet bombs. That dude's head exploded. What the heck was that? And it exploded right in front of me. I didn't even get a chance to save him. Okay, well, uh, we'll go that way after. Rip. F, F. Bernard, right? F. Bernard, dude, his head just exploded right in front of- How many bodies do you have, huh? Why is this dude just talking? This guy reminds me of, uh... Oh, dude, you know what would be so cool to play? What, what's that game with the zombies in the mall? Dead... Dead... Uh... The one with... The, puppets, huh? the investigator guy. Maybe you starve. Dead Rising? Dude, we played Dead Rising? That'd be badass. This guy's reminding me of the Dead Rising guy from the uh, the chef in the in the mall. I mean, I guess the whole entire thing's in a mall, right? But you know what I'm talking about? The chef? Frank West, investigative journalist. Hell yeah. Dude, that ending when he like 
has no shirt on. I guess it's it's depending on what you're wearing, right? But he's in a freaking tank. Oh my god, dude. Oh my god, this is so stupid. Happy birthday, daddy. Oh my god, don't don't clip that. Connecting to satellite. It's COM4. TS COM4. Connection established. Uh, wait. Oh, this is a file. Bro, I feel like this is like some dude with his Discord kitten. Hi, Daddy. Happy birthday. Okay, never mind. It's actually present, genuine. But you'll have to open it when you get home because your company has lame rules. What the fuck? Guess what? I finally trotted with Lita. It was awesome. Um, what else? Excuse oh, me. Ren peed in one of your cowboy boots. <laughs> Sorry. I really miss you. Tell Mr. Yu I said kids should be allowed in space. Uh, um, I, I don't know about that one, kiddo. I love you. I don't think that kid should be here at all. I see why this kid's not allowed in space or kids in general. I got some weird Typhon stuff here. What is happening? Bruce Cobb. Well, you know, at least he's not Bruce on the Cobb. You know, I mean, dude. Oh, shit. I'm hilarious, brother. What the hell is happening? What is going on? Oh! It's a poltergeist. Well, we've been new, but... More specimens required. Oh, I mind-jacked him on accident. That's not what I meant to do. For some reason, I thought we had Psy powers. But now that he's mind-jacked... Oh, no target. Never mind. Hold on. We have to wait until he's not friendly anymore. Oh, shoot. Did the poltergeist just blow his head up? Oh my god. Bro, that was wild. He just popped his head. Wait, if he was invisible, do we not get his parts? Does that mean his parts are invisible now? Wait, that's what is that's that's a scam. What? What a scam, dude. Unless we can find his invisible parts laying around then. The poltergeist did not head pop. What? I wonder I wonder how that guy had like he just came down and then he just his head exploded. Wait. Wait a second, don't- don't tell me that their attack, the people who are- what is it? Who are mind-controlled? Don't tell me their attack is to run at you and then their head explodes. Harvest the super fruit? Oh, we can get that in a bit. We'll do that after this area. Don't tell me that's what their ability is. Oh no. They run at you and their head explodes. Ow. I- well, I hit the mimic. It's how Ronnie died too? Oh, uh, I, I didn't even see how Ronnie died. Okay. So I guess their head just explodes then. That kind of sucks. If you can't like save them in time. Before they, they aggro and run at you, I guess. Character sheet. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. We're going to listen to this first. Stab fellow. Stab fellow. The she the DM. Sign of him is his blood trail. This is so cool. Much. The flagstones seem to drink in the blood. The cracks glistening red. Oh, Jesus Christ on a stick, Abigail. Don't be such a baby. We either head through the door. Oh, forget that. It just ate our warrior. Unless you can handle the entire path of rat men, oh spellless wonder. <laughs> we don't have much choice. Elias, sorry. Stab fellow. Stab fellow. Stab fellow. Can I answer her? Hell no! You hear nothing from the darkness. It has swallowed Stabfellow. Come oh, shoot. Alright, let me light a torch. Hey guys, sorry I'm late. Station-wide OS upgrade. Had of course, the late guy. The whole process. Abby, do you have my character sheet? You made it. 
Yes, right here. Wait, what? Oh, that was an echo from them too? That's so funny. Okay. <clears throat> What's this note? Stab Fellows treasure map. Uh, do they all have treasure maps? Cat, what are you doing? You're being a weirdo right now. I think she's under my bed just going ham. Wait, what is this? Is this like hot or cold? Is this like a UFO? Captain Stab... Yeah, my bad. Captain Stab Fellows treasure map. These don't look like real areas, at least not to me. Like, like not, um, uh, here at least. Abigail voice cab. She left her key card here? There's no other notes. All right, well, let's, let's take a look at those character sheets then. Captain stab fellow. Oh, wait, we saw this sheet already. What? We already saw the stab, stab fellow sheet. What's this? Rosalind Swift. Of course. Long brown hair. I can't read that. It's too small. 10 strength. 13. Dude, she got she got pretty good rolls. What the hell is this? Rosalind Swift. Dude, they got... You know, any, any person who plays a ranger having a normal name. <laughs> or, or like a, a rogue has a normal name. Classic. And they're human. Classic. Classic. I'm sorry. <laughs> Dude, they got some pretty good rolls on their stuff though. God dang. Uh, what is this? Longbow and dagger. <clears throat> Rope, mirror. What is that? Animal snare. Bedroll. Provisions. Okay. Pat, what are you doing? I think she's climbing in the curtains. You're not, you're not supposed to be doing that right now. That's pretty neat. All right, next. Horden Baffle Flag Dastrous. <laughs> we already know the name, but it's still funny, dude. Strength 7, okay, valid. Intelligence 17, Dex 14, Jesus. Con 11, these are some good rolls. A great wizard name. What an amazing wizard name, dude. And a great drawing, too. A staff of Flowers. Dagger in, in blood mail, blood nail, blood nail. Okay, I'm assuming these are like scrolls or whatever. Like the the skills down here is interesting. Uh, what is this? Wine skin, spell tome, ink and quill, scroll case, magnifying glass, lantern. I like how it has all the erased stuff on it. Bedroll compass. What is this? Oh, that's gold. Oh, this is money. This is like platinum, gold, silver, and copper. I couldn't read that before because it was so hard to see. Is this iron? Platinum, gold, silver, copper, iron. I still can't read the last three. It's it, The text is too small and I can't zoom on it. Flag dastrous. Oh my god, dude. Horden Baffle Flag Dastrous. <clears throat> Remember, blind ogres can call for help with gongs. Try to distract Flag Dastrous from using White Gem against Necro. Plus one lock bonus to whoever figures out Drip's Riddle. Drip. Dude, his name is Drip. Dude, this guy got the Drip. What a name. This is really cool. I enjoyed that. Did that mimic die? It looked like it died of, uh, died of fall damage. Uh, is that turret destroyed? It looks like it's destroyed because it's not turning. Who's this guy? Brett Sato. Why do you have biohazard waste on him? Okay. I wonder if they have a fabricator in here. It looks like you can do some like cool parkour stuff maybe. But oh, we won't. Fatal Fortress Game Master's Tome, 6th edition. 
Greetings, Game Master! Fatal Fortress is a world deprived of sunlight. As Game Master, you will guide a troop of stalwart adventures through glittering caves crawling with ratmen, into battles against horrors that have slept for centuries, and deep into the secret heart of the Fatal Fortress itself. Unlike other games, Fatal Fortress has no set character classes, instead encouraging players to play their own way by mixing and matching abilities as they are faced with new challenges. This game also features a dramatic magic system, where players create their own spells by drawing and combining runes. That's kinda badass. Each player will need a character record sheet, a miniature to represent their character on the combat map, a full set of polyhedral dice, and a thirst for danger. I like how you said there's no classes yet there's a wizard rogue <laughs> and, a, and a melee dude. That's how the video game plays too or close to it with like no magic. You Probably just like with runes. That is honestly really cool. Not gonna lie. Mimic corpse. Oh, I'm, my inventory is full. How much can we get out of these? This doesn't drop a lot of minerals so we'll do that. A shotgun in this too so... Okay. Ah, uh, we didn't go up there. I wish there was a way to like make markers on the map. Or maybe there is a way? It doesn't look like there are markers. It'd be cool to like make markers and be like, I want to come back here later. Excuse me. Um. I'm going to assume that the stupid poltergeist did this. Let me through! Are you kidding me? It's a cart! It's a cart! I should be able to move this because it has wheels! Oh my god. I'll just recycle it, five head. Nah, no, it's fine. I'll just crawl through. There's a reason those archetypes are popular. When I play TTRPGs, people tend to follow an archetype no matter how a game tries to leave behind class systems. Yeah, I mean, not only that, but... What is that saying that, like, Asmongold always says? Or maybe it's not a saying that he always says, but it's pretty much what games prove, and it's like, whenever people try to ditch archetype stuff, or ditch the trinity, it just never works out. Uh, it doesn't look like there's a way in here besides, uh... What, what are those? It was like weapon upgrades, <clears throat> a case with maybe two sides in it. Maybe those are nine millimeter guns too, or nine millimeter ammo. I don't see a way in. Oh uh, yeah, it doesn't look like it. Look at the drawings, it's cute. Um, email. Please help me, there's someone trying to enter my room, I have nowhere to hide, hurry. Uh, basement in space. Seriously, my quarters have no view of space, no windows at all. What is the one thing that visitors staying on a space station might enjoy? Surely you have better quarters for Argentino... Ar Argentino Pero. Not sparkling. I don't know what passes for sparkling wine on board Talos, but I assure you the flat piss your concierge delivered does not qualify. I poured it into the toilet where it belongs. What the... I want a replacement as soon as possible. Better yet, would be a bottle... Of that Sardar bourbon, I understand your CEO likes. And more glasses as well. The others are broken. Fitness center. Was, wait, was there a code for that? Oh, it's in here. FYI, the code to the fitness center has changed. Fitness center has changed. Too many people had given out the code to employees that didn't have the service docked from their pay stubs. New one is 8938. In case anyone who, who's paid for it forgets it. Thanks. Well, we didn't pay for it, but we still got it. Oh yeah, I didn't like check anything, did I? Uh, we don't have any corpses to look at, do we? Download area map. See if there's a fabricator here. <clears throat> there is a fabricator in the kitchen. There's no recycler though. There's an operator dispenser in the medical bay. Uh, maybe there's a way to look into the storage from the medical bay. Uh, what do we got on level 2? Uh, we do have a recycler there, and there's a fitness center. This place is huge! Oh my god. 
I can't believe those guys are like really spoiled. Like you're here to work. You're not here to lux to have luxurious stuff, right? But we're we're definitely recycling this. This is getting recycler charged 100%. Um, what is that? It looks like a phantom? I don't know what kind of phantom it is. Uh oh. Oh, it's Regina Sellers. Surprise! Uh, okay, so we got their stuff, med kit, expired plasma bag. I definitely want the Asai Hypo. Med kit. I wonder if there's a way to... There's, uh, there's gotta be no way to do that. Anti-rad, test tube sample. There's definitely no way to... Medical operator. To change them back to human, right? I, I would not expect there to be a way. What are you doing? Hello. Calm down, cat. Thank you. I'm constantly forgetting that this is supposed to be a scary game. There she goes. Authorized personnel only. This is the recycler. Weapon upgrade kit, we can use that. All this stuff. Supplies from Morgan. Mike, when you're heading up to the exec suites to fix the cooling system there, can you bring Morgan the, these supplies? By the way, the code to the grav shaft has been changed. It's 8088. Executive suites. Well, at least we found that. We can recycle quite a lot of things here too, actually. Put in the junk. Uh, move this over. Uh, move this over. Transfer? Oh, okay, we just press transfer. Um, transfer that. Okay, do we have anything here that we don't really need? We can transfer the EMP charges that we have that are extra. There's too many, so many of them. Uh, look at all these repair, suit repair kits we have. That's actually kind of nutty how many we have put some in and I think this is good yeah all right recycle <clears throat> look at all that stuff nice I'll do a normal save as well because it's been a while okay. um what do we need to do now oops it's broken turrets Only a turret. It's this guy. Who's this? Mike Turner. No, not Mike. That's the guy who, uh, the maintenance guy. Rip. Rip the maintenance guy. Mike Turner, the maintenance guy. That doesn't work at all. Um, theaters up here. That's a mimic. I think it would be really cool to also like spec into the uh the wrench. It's kind of weird that the wrench is a spec and not like an update. Wait, did I say that? The wrench is a neuro mod and not an upgrade. I don't know what the hell I was trying to say there. Look at all this alcohol. Oh my god. Speaking of which chat, I bought some I bought some sake the other day. So not only do I have Long Island iced teas in a can, but I also have some sake. So depending on whenever I want to do that stream, you know, the uh, drinking stream, it'll be very fun. This needs power. Mm -hmm. I'm not, I'm not going to get too crazy on it, but it's still... <laughs> Can we start going with some almond break? 
start going ham on the the drum and bass. Guy Jameson. Wait, is that guy's name Guy? Who names their their child Guy? Who just names their child Guy? Unless that's like a nickname they have for him. What is this? Local breaker yellow toilet power? Guy is not a crazy uncommon name. Is it not? <laughs> is Guy Fury actually like a name? Is Guy his name? Or is that a meme? What is here? How did I miss that? Kira Whitman. This has to be below us, right? Yo, look at all that blood. Yellow tulip supply closet. That's where we turned the power on for it, wasn't it? I guess we turned the... Oh, this place is probably called the Yellow Tulip, huh? Tulip, huh? Oh shit, can we sing? Why are there suddenly a Mimic here? No new data. There's another Mimic here, I think. No? I thought I heard another one. My question is, why are there suddenly mimics in here after I turn the power on? That clearly wasn't there before. I mean, they snuck in. Doing a little bit of a sneaky, breaky, cheeky, breaky, you know? Sneaky, peaky, cheeky, breaky. Cheeky, breaky. Boom. 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 Clark Rafferty. Oh, I guess there's one more cystoid. A theater. Rising stars. Uh, I think we saw this before. Reservation scanner. Use. Welcome, Morgan Yu. Please swipe your tracking bracelet to recall your reservation. Well, at least we know where Morgan Yu. If we have his bracelet on. Huh, chairs that lock when lowered? <laughs> um, I don't think anything's gonna play on the... Maybe if I hit it, it'll work. Nah, I don't think anything's playing. Why is there glass on the ground? It looks like... It looks like there's something up in the rafters, right? Huh. Why is there oil or fire pipe going through here? Huh. Definitely looks like there's something here. Oh. Hello, cystoid nests. Oh, that doesn't really do what I thought it would have. In transgressions. It's kind of strange. I guess these are more of nests, huh? I like how they have headphones and everything, so you can use headphones if you really want to. Ow. I don't think it's gonna start. It's also in a projector, which is kind of weird. You'd expect the theaters to maybe be a little bit bigger. Right? I don't think the movie's playing. 
But there is a maintenance tunnel here. Let's see if I can blast this out of the way. Without blasting myself, that is. There we go. Oh. Oh, this is the, uh... The tunnel from the other side, right? Yeah. That's here. Um... There's no reason to be here. Okay. I do really like how they let you do things your way. Like, if you can figure out how to do it somehow, then you can do it. In, like, your build. I really do enjoy that. And especially with, like, the Neuromod thing, I think you mentioned this before, Knight, with how, uh... With where, like, if you wanted to do stealth only, or something like that, you can pretty much do it because you don't need to kill things to to level up. You pretty much just get the materials. I don't think there's going to be anything here. I guess it was worth a look, but... I guess it was worth looking, but I don't think anything's here. Just need them Nero mods. Hell yeah, brother. I'm surprised there's not like a... Just like a dead body hanging from the rafters up here. I guess there wouldn't really be a reason for someone to go up there unless they're hiding. Killing stuff helps for exotic material, but there's a bunch of it around. Yeah, there's, there's a bunch of stuff around, which is always nice, too. Yeah. What we got in here? Let's put this stuff in the recycler. Transfer, transfer junk, transfer that. Uh, do I have any duplicates? Transfer this. Um, uh, did I have an extra of anything else? I thought I would have. I guess not. He's like another trick. Assuming it wasn't patched, you can take smaller objects you can carry and shove heavier objects with them. Hmm. That sounds interesting. Well, uh, I mean, we can try that too. Let's try it out. If we come across something like that. Like, we can't move that for some reason. Let's see if we can... That's probably not going to work with that. <laughs> A movie poster. Maybe... Were you able to do it when you had them? Or did you have to, like, throw it? Because it seems like... They... They don't collide when you're holding them, so that might be, a. Uh, that might be where it's patched out, possibly. Unconscious. When it was in my hand, like this, yeah, it might, it might not work. It seems to not collide with anything. They disabled the collision! Unless you still mean something else. Did we did we check that medical room? Might be patched, which was fair. It made leverage completely unnecessary. Yeah, that's fair. Diagnosing superficial injuries. Nothing affordable medical can handle. Please hold still. This will only take a moment. All done. You can fill out a service questionnaire at the front desk. Hmm. Not that it stopped you from getting leverage so I can pile up everything in a room to recycle it. <laughs> That's valid. I don't think I'll be able to... I... Okay, so my, my thing is... If I do get up there, it's like I don't really have a course of action because I can't do anything through the gate. I don't think I can morph through it. I can't shoot anything through it. This exists. 
Maybe there's no, there's probably no way to get in for the, from the top floor. Let's just look around. Uh oh. Did it look like that was a, a mind controlled name? This is kind of spooky. You know the code for this, right? Yeah. Nine, three, eight, yes. We just use counter spell. We're pretty much just counter spelling everyone, to be honest. Counter spell, counter spell, counter spell. Oh, this is Rosalind. Oh, this was her when she kept saying, don't come. Is Abby with you? Are you okay? It's not me. It's don't come. Not Any comers? I don't come. <laughs> I won't. I won't do it. Sus. You can't. Abigail, I'm recording this time. You too, Emma. It's fine. Danielle's joining us. She'll cover us if we get into trouble. She said yes? We negotiated. I had to say yes to some things too. I love how one of the people that we need the voice for is the girl who's playing D&D, &D, right? So we get to listen to like their whole entire D&D &D shtick go on. Who keeps an apple in a locker? Who keeps disruptor batteries in a locker? Jeez, those lockers were stacked. Those lockers were crazily stacked. Those things out everything. Is that a... That's a techno, right? I know we can just go around it, but... I want to be safe. Yeah, I'm back. Welcome back, Sammy. Welcome back. Yay! Yay! Welcome back. Did a lot of chores. That's good. That means you don't have to do them later. Chat, what if one day... I start stream and I just go full schizo mode. Would you still love me if I was a worm? No, I'm joking. I'm joking. Don't fucking answer that. Because I wouldn't. Freaking just turn on stream one day and just start going full freaking schizo. Non-stop. Freaking crazy hype. Acting like... The, the usual VTubers that are always like going crazy, bouncing off the walls, kind of. Oh, we already know this. Oh, because this is where we sent this from. Or that's where the person sent this. Greetings, adventurers. Each, each of you should have a map fragment, my down. I managed to hand them to some of you in person. Others might have noticed a new file on your workstations after the last session. They are map, map fragments. Work together and figure out the clues. Once you have, return to my quarters and you will be given your prize. Your humble game master, Abigail. So we gotta go to Abigail's. Oh, are we missing one of the maps? We're missing Show's map, huh? That's a lot of people. Oh my god. And we have to kill the telepath first, though. So we either mind we we save the dudes from the mind break, or we kill the telepath, right? I must. I don't know if using my psi power to disrupt the the telepath um, breaks the 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 mind thing. You know what I mean? Because I have the thing that nullifies the mind. Oh shit! Just get the fuck out of me. 
I don't know if the one that I have that nullifies Psy powers will actually work against the, the Telepath or not. Like, I'm sure it'll disrupt it and make it run away, but I don't know if it'll clear the mind, the, the mind control of the dudes as well. You know what I mean? It's pretty okay though, because as long as they just walk at me like this, it shouldn't be too bad. You guys don't even have anything. These poor guys. Um, what do I have in terms of Nero mods? Because if I have enough Nero mods, I was going somewhere with this. Hold on. Um, if I have enough Nero mods, I can. What was I gonna do? Honestly, this might be good, just to negate stun. Hmm. Oh, this is like, this is literally a fireball. Oh wait, no, it's not a fireball. Does it just like put traps on the ground and they have to walk over it? Well, first of all, if we have enough, we can get lift field, and that should help us with our mobility to get around to random stuff easily, which would be really cool. So then we'd have more more ways to, like, break into two areas. But, like, I feel like we already have enough of that. Um, what I really want to get is more Psycho Shock. But these, use, these require so many Neuro Mods, man. They require so many Nero mods. But what 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 did I want to get? It was something I wanted to get with it, and I just don't remember. I don't care about the psionic aptitude because I don't feel like we need to really increase our pull anymore. Um I don't really care about the stuff there. Security, I don't think I really care about any of this either. Honestly, I think it would be cool to get stealth. The uh, the stealth upgrades, but I think we're good. Uh, I don't even remember what I wanted to get. <clears throat> Screw it, let's go for it. Come over here. I like how there's just a bunch of corpses laying here. Or I guess they're not corpses. Some of them are... Some, well, some of them are corpses. Some are unconscious. There's only one guy over there now. One person. The telepath is just looking at the ground. Is the telepath looking over here? It looks like he's just staring at the wall, right? Maybe it's looking outside. So basically what I'm thinking of doing is I'm going to glue it. Uh, yeah, I'm going to glue it, hit it with the uh, Neuro Shock. No, I'm going to Kinetic Blast and then hit it with the Neuro Shock. And then just run up and just start going ham. Alright? Let's go. Let's do this. Run away, you coward! Actually, stop running. Oh, it's still on cooldown. Oh! Oh, shoot! Oh! Oh, no! Oh, no! Oh, shit! Uh... <laughs> oh, fuck. <laughs> you know, maybe having that lift power here would be, uh... Good, right? <laughs> oh, shit. Ow. Oh, he's too far away. Um, oh crap, I accidentally took off the glue gun. Wait, what the heck did I just, just replace? This is the glue cannon, right? Glue cannon wrench. There we go.
Oh, I have to reload. You have glide thrusters? Oh yeah, that's right. I forgot. Man, there's so much stuff in this game. I always for Oh god. There's so much stuff in this game. I always forget what I have. Like, there's so many different ways you can handle things that I just forget, like, I have part of my kit. You know what I mean? Because you're thinking about Psy powers, you're thinking about glue cannon, you're thinking about wrench, you're thinking about shotgun. Grenades, dude! Six consoles! As the, as the, uh, what is it, the French-Canadian guy says. There's so much. Was there anything even in here? I, maybe now that we killed the telepath, the guy is not going to be crazy or something. I wonder if there's even anything up there. Like on the, uh, what is it called? The, uh, the lights, I guess. What's up here? No, I don't see anything. Did we check the pool that well? I don't think we did. No, it was just a body that we killed. Hope that fire didn't roast one of the unconscious people. Oh, that would suck. Um. I don't know what happened to that guy. I'll tell you that much. But his head's not there anymore. Pretty sure none of their heads exploded in here. Unless the fire melted the guy's head off. Then that would suck. Let's go visit people's cabins. This is kind of creepy, I'm not gonna lie. Just creeping on people in their cabins. Let's put on mind jack. The corpse vanishes. Oh yeah, this is this place, huh? Green bottle, green beetle gin. I'm gonna lock these behind me. I don't feel safe going in here. I don't know what these people are talking about. I like these crew cabins. They're nice and cozy. Kinetic amp. We need that. That would be very cool to use. Uh, boost damage done by kinetic blast. Remove this. Maybe we can replace. How how do we uninstall? There we go. <clears throat> Morgan U Typhon research data. Transfer data. Scan complete. Was. By the way, is the voice changing or is it just me? I don't know if you were there earlier night, but... Wait, did I just gain this? No, I probably have to... Oh! It likes... Wait, no, what? Do I just have this available now? I have no clue. I think it just gave us that. Okay. I feel like the, the voice is getting more and more robotic. Or maybe I just wasn't paying attention in the beginning. It's kind of weird. Pizza. Honestly, pizza and space, dude. Oh, they have like a little tree in here, too. What are these people complaining about? Exotic materials, recycler charge. <gasps> yes, recycler charge. Heavy gear optimizer. What is this? Increases movement and aiming speed while firing the glue cannon or Q-beam. That's pretty neat. Radiation resistance pretty good. Oh, we already had one of these. Um, let's put on a radiation shielding. Right? I wonder if we can, like, uh, recycle them or something. Periodic table of elements. The dude just has a giant periodic table just laying there. Okay. Email. Dr. Thorstein. Just wanted to write you personally that I thank you for the new reployer. Uh, I know people have been waiting to get uh, on wait waiting lists to get one of these. And it was a pleasant surprise to find a new one in my office this morning. Have we read these before? It is this feeling of gratitude that makes it awkward for me to trouble you further. However, if you could spare one of your engineers for a bit, it would be great. You could swing by and show me exactly what it does. 
Wanted to clear a Morgan request again. Morgan was down in hardware today. I was offered to help. Morgan asked for operator parts. I asked if the last ones we had sent. Yeah, these I, I feel like the the email if they're new they they will be checked off still I guess. Or how how do I say this? If we've read them before, they're going to not have a check mark, and you can read them on the other PCs that they were sent from. I would assume. This kind of isn't as scary as I thought it would have been. Elizabeth Bay. There's something down there though, it seems. Ooh, that's kind of spooky. Hendrik the Vries cabin. Oh. That doesn't seem very good. Um, what do we got? Table. Bro, this dude went out, well, you know, in a crumpled paper type of way. Uh-huh. Entity rad, fabrication, blah, blah, blah. Corpse, just looting dead bodies, don't mind me. Okay, cool. Well, there wasn't really anything there, huh? Monka S, dude. Is this just- I wonder if all the, the named people are normal phantoms. They all- I think the named people are usually normal phantoms, huh? At least that's what it's seeming like. What is this, a useless circuit board? It's not useless if we can throw it in the fabricator, but we don't have room for that right now. Daniel shows cabin. Oh, they might have their, uh... The- the- the treasure- the treasure chest. The tre the last treasure map. Danielle, missed you, leaving your character sheet here. But I have a spare in case you don't make it back before the game. And don't worry, it looks great. See you at the rec center. What a nice friend. Melindra Shadow Corner. What? <laughs> Shadow Corner? <laughs> This shit edgy. Melindra Shadow Corner. Oh my god. Strength 12, Int 10, Dex 17, Con 14. Damn, that's a lot of... These are some god rolls, dude. This the beginner's luck dog... Uh, god roll. Daggers and darts. What is this? Dagger plus 2 to hit 1d6. Uh, What do we got? Darts. 1d3. Interesting little detail about our inventory. Uh, let's let's see. Flask of oil, torch, machete. Uh, I can't read that. I'll go back to it after. Bedroll, flint and steel, torch, tor, compass, precious ruby. What what does that say? Creek, something in food, flask maybe. I can't, I can't read that. That looks like sneak. Sneaking skill up. Bro, she loaded. Four platinum, five gold, goddamn. Wait, didn't someone else had a precious ruby and they had it crossed off so that they give it to Shadow Corner maybe? I don't know what that is. But what is, what is Torque plus one? Was this, uh, wasn't there something that they wanted to make three of her items are the same items crossed off other characters' sheets? Oh, so they gave it to her. Isn't this, yeah, I was going to say, is, isn't this one the, the ruby or something like that in the note where it was like, make sure the, the, what is it? Make sure the wizard, um doesn't use the uh what is it make sure the wizard doesn't use the uh the gem or something like that and doesn't she have it gave the item to the rogue oh yeah i guess that makes sense she she stole them huh quote gave although the precious ruby was crossed off so they probably knew right 
at that point. At least, at least whoever had the precious ruby, that was that was a what's his face, right? That was Captain Captain Guy Man. <laughs> I forgot his name. I guess that's funny. That makes sense if, if she stole them. That's pretty funny. Isn't wasn't she like supposed to be the the new person or something? Stab fellow captain, stab fellow. Yeah, there it is. A crumpled, incomplete, handwritten note. Abby, it felt more personal to write you a note. But still not as terrifying as trying to apologize to you in person. I know I'm a coward and I don't trust, but I don't trust what I'm going to say. Abby, I'm not good at this. That's obvious. Words, words, blah. Abby, sometimes the words come running out of your mouth and I want to catch them all, but it's too late. They're out there, I. Find missing transcribe. Check feeder. Did we find a missing transcribe in there? Get my stuff from Abby's cabin. Finish draft of apology letter. Pull head out of ass. Prioritize relationships over work. Wait, did we, was there a transcribe in the theater? Uh, tracking bracelet. We don't really need this though, do we? Like we... Oh. Oh, is the transcribe broken? What are you doing? Are you recording this? Joint transcribes are fun. They are not. It's like mental scrapbooking. You both save the moments that matter. Um, I wonder if the tracking bracelet is the, uh, the bodies, right? Like, if you, if you want to track the, uh, the bodies from the security thing, I wonder if that's what that is. It's, uh, tracking the bracelet, not, like, the person itself. Wait, I had to have missed something, right? Isn't there, don't they all have treasure maps? Maybe she doesn't have a treasure map. Maybe it's in, like, her files or something. Huh. Okay. Oh wait, these ones... Will these move? No, they won't. They will if you throw it at it, but we can carry that. Files. Conversation with Archive 0412. It's a date. Uh, well, what's this first? My password. Lorenzo Calvino's password acquired. From Daniel's show. Dr. Calvino. For starters, if you have any more questions about passwords, please email the IT department and don't use my personal address. Second, you should never type your password into an email. Um, regardless of how tight our security is, you never know. Thanks. My workstation said that it was time to update my password. I wanted to know if it was okay to use Kublai Khan and whether that fits your requirements regards. Oh my god, literally the, the next email. The next email or reply. Never type your password into an email. Preparing for the concert. Hey, Danielle, I'm pulling a late shift on the bridge tonight. Search Sky Habitation Pod for samples of Daniel Show's voice. Um, On the bridge tonight, I left my transcribe in my pod. Could I convince you to bring it for me on your way to deep storage. By the way, I have I some ideas for making our uniforms look a little more pop star for our demonstration at the Tulip. Don't be scared. I'm not gonna lie, whatever thing they had going on here seems really cool. We haven't found Daniel Show's thing yet, have we? It's a date. Ooh. Nope, this sounded serious, Ooh. so I wanted to shut my transcribe off. So, okay, so you're asking me if it's okay to record our game on the transcribes yes uh, i know using the memory it's not right <clears throat> i can't be having this conversation oh I i'm so sorry i'm gonna lose my job for even talking to you about this what what exactly what you're going to do is have dinner with me what you say what a lot when you should say yes <sighs> yes see gay all settled don't worry about the transcribes it's not against regulation so, are you going to invite me to this game or not? New transcribe. Dear future us, today, future us, we are not calling ourselves that. Today, I was able to convince my Gay. beautiful stubborn <laughs> partner to stubborn to stay in bed and not report for an extra shift. And this is the reward I get. 
Oh, I didn't even notice there was a note here. Hey, you've apparently misplaced your transcribe again. Just wanted you to know I still have some of your stuff in my room. Don't know if you want to back call me or something, Abby. Okay. I guess that makes sense. Electric Junction. What's this? El Calvino. Oh, this doesn't look good. What? Does he have a giant looking glass? Oh my god, that's so cool! What? Dude, this guy gets a whole ass looking glass in here? That looks so cool, dude. Look at that, it's a mini town. The lighthouse. Very neat. No. Uh, May 23. Uh, why is this guy stuck on May 23rd? Anniversary rem reminder. Oh. Anniversary reminder for May 23rd. New key code? Calvino's safe. 2323. Um, where is his safe? That's the question. Looking glass on, looking glass off. Uh, visor prototype. Entry 1. Never. I have never removed a neuromod. Uh, and yet, today, I could not find my way. Oh, he's the not removing labs. neuromods? I the arboretum for an, an hour. I made some excuse. Was he making this up with the looking glass here? I know. Here? Me, you suspect. I cannot keep making toys for Transtar when... Uh, I told Alex what I want to try. He gave me a device to help. Parapsychological contraption. Morgan made it. Some Morgan. of the components are beyond me. This dream again. There is something wrong with this station. That's so cool. Something here with us, but I am hallucinating now. There, uh, there, there is no question. I tried to open the locker, but I, I could not remember our anniversary. And oh, that's why he wrote it down. Even her name escaped me. Her name. If one day I wake up and cannot even remember the work I am doing, I must give it all to Morgan. He will know what to do with it. First test. Anterior electrodes overheated uh, after six seconds. But I swear, there was a moment I saw her again. The day we met on the Costa Amalfi, her lemon sundress, my Clorinda. Clorinda. This poor guy is going crazy, man. Is that where his safe is? Man, I don't want to have to break the looking glass. Well. 05230. Oh. 0523. Oh, shit. I should change that. Um, okay. We can't repair our suit, so well. So he gave us some Nero mods. Hell yeah, dude. Oh, we should probably like recycle all this shit. We have six Nero mods now. Oh my god, dude! I love Nero mods. Oh boy, I love Nero mods. I'm waiting for you to nuke an unconscious person with that. <laughs> I was very, very careful not to. That was on my mind as well, to be honest. No, this better not be like the treasure note. By the way, Kuki, how are you? I'm okay. How are you? I'm I'm doing good, you know. We're just we're just vibing, chilling out. Um, playing Bidja game. Um You know the usual I'm I'm excited to like start playing uh, new games and stuff like that and there's like a lot of really cool stuff coming out so I'm really excited for that to uh, uh like uh to release soon you know like on record and everything so for me I'm, I'm doing good I'm doing all right I'm all happy and everything I'm normal we're doing we're doing good I hope you're doing good as well no no like weird problems going on or anything 
Just uh, pretty, pretty normal, pretty boring, actually. <laughs> Just play game. Bill, if you're injured or sick, you get a pass. Otherwise, it is 75 minutes of exercise per week. Minimum. Code to gym is 8938 in case you forgot. There's like so many places to get the code. When am I going to play Bramble? Um, I think it's on sale right now, but also like I'd have to juggle Bramble. I did think about it. Um, I want to play Armored Core like real soon, but I also do want to play Bramble. So I might have to juggle in between Bramble and Armored Core if we decide to do that. What? But I'll... I'll have a better... No new data? Do I already have it all? Yeah, I do. He's like right on top of me. Oh, he died. Okay. That wasn't the last one. There's multiple poltergeists. Oh my god. But yeah, we'll we'll try and start we'll try and start it soon. Maybe along the week or something. I'm not sure, maybe next weekend. Because I don't know how many people are really going to be interested in armored core that much. I hope a lot of people. I hope a lot. So I might do armored core during the week. Cuz I think uh, I don't know if you zoomers are going to be like super interested in armored core. But I'll try and do that during the week, and then I'll do, like, Bramble and pray on the weekend or something. Anders, your package arrived. Front desk. If I'm not there, the code 7114 on the gate. I won't tell anyone if you don't. Thank God we know what it is now. Thank God. We can finally access that room. Galagos Habitation Pod. Transcribe. Take a view for your contribution. Officer Files. Malia. I have an important request. It's sensitive, though. I need to know I can trust you with a surveillance matter. Uh, yes, of course, sir. It's just that normally I can't do something like that without consent from Chief Elazar HR and another director. I didn't even press anything. Those people report to me, Milia. Yes, sir. I understand. I want you to keep an eye on Annalise Gallegos. Where she goes. Oh, Gallegos. Visitors. I'll log everything on the security computer. Good. Send me a report at the end of the week. Yes, sir. All right, I see. Man, I'm pretty tired from yesterday. Your arms hurt because one of those basketball games in the arcade. You, your arms hurt from throwing some basketballs? <laughs> the yellow tool of generous for a private celebration of Transstar success. Alex Toast and Review. Crew Demonstration. That's pretty cool. On you, Sky. Just a neuromod hangover. I feel a neuromod weird. hangover. I can't believe you got modded for Alex's clown show at the Tulip. Are you kidding? I've always wanted to play an instrument, but never had the time. It's so. It's like I can see the sheet music in my head. I feel like I've been doing this since I was seven. 
Besides, you are going to be on stage with me, right? Only to catch you if you suddenly collapse. And only if you keep me from punching Alex if I drink too much. Haha. <laughs> I hope, uh, we can find the, the treasure chest around here somewhere, right? It says your friend challenged you. He lost. He lost at Basketobaru. Well, I guess I can't say anything. <laughs> it's been a long time since I played basketball as well. Basketobaru. Hi, mommy. I've been having bad dreams since you left Dr. Preston's. Wait, since you left. Wait, what? Since you left Dr. Preston. Excuse me. Said I should draw it and that would help me help make them go away. Hope you like my picture and come home soon. Love you, Corey. With a capital R. Corey with a capital R. <laughs> Is there anything on up on those? How do these people get up to their second floor ones? Like, do they have to crawl up here? Oh, there's a character sheet! What the game? It's Rosalind Swift! You don't play basketball at all? You're more in the badminton? Uh, yeah, I've not, I don't think... I've only played badminton, like, once before. And it was, uh... What, what was it? It's just, like, a fun little thing that I do with, uh, my parents up here. For, um... <clears throat> what is Emma? For... Uh, just, just, like, hanging out and stuff like that. Moonshine, basketball glove, Granger's me memory, memoirs. <sighs> I need to sneeze. Never mind, I think it went away. Should be still be down there playing. My guys need me. My shoulder just couldn't deliver. I couldn't deliver. I brought a lot of autograph gloves with me. And pass them out like candy at Halloween, but it turns out a lot of the test tubers don't follow sports at all. Much less know about my career, short as it was. Oh yeah, I remember this. What are the chances Mr. Yu could set me up with Neuromods I need that put me back in the game? Hell, he could buy a franchise and stock it with the greatest players that ever lived. If I got a Neuromod, would it be me playing? The League would never let modded players in, but how would they know? <laughs> Classic sports peoples trying to cheat chat. Classic competition cheaters. As usual, let's see if we can check what these are. Lawrence Baxter and Joshua Vanstry. No, this guy has like a controller. That's cool. And he has some udon. Some udon nudoru. Ah, that was a weird super jump. Lawrence Baxter. <laughs> You've got me really curious. Are you ready for your instructions, my lady? This Yo. better not get us into trouble. Not too much trouble, anyway. <clears throat> First, you must journey to the tree where we carved our initials. And what if I bump into Julian Howard? Run like hell. Julian the Ogre does not like people touching his trees. Or his, uh, fruit. <laughs> Probably be a lot less grumpy. Anyway. Beneath a stone, you will find a magical key card. This key card will unlock everything your heart desires. Oh, well, I don't need a key for that. And don't worry about work. Michaela said you could take an extra shift since it's your birthday. What? That was kind of... Yeah. That was interesting. Find the tree with the lover's initials in the Arboretum. Oh my god. That dude's role-playing, dude. He's not even playing with their D&D &D group. I'm like, who's this? He's not even in there, I don't think. We didn't have this unlocked already? I'm surprised I walked past this. Huh. That's strange. <laughs> He's a limpsa main, dude. He's limpsa maining. Oh no. Fatal Fortress. We already saw that. Maybe shows thing is in here. Boom. Oh. Why is this place torn apart? Big Bang Candy. No. The Yellow Tulip. Oh, you've seen that. Abigail 
fully. We really don't have that. I could just put a point in the hacking because it looks like there's a lot of level 1 hacking stuff. You know? Did I walk past this too? No. I think this got pushed in front of it. Yeah, it did. Okay. Well, we have to go this way now. Let's see what's over here. Golden gun. What is this, 007? Ooh, that's not... That's, that's, that's Metal Gear Solid. What a thrill. With darkness and silence through the night. Starbender. My enemies, my enemies. Wait, what? My enemies, enemies, enemy. 9mm bullets. Stuff. Oh, we have this person's... Okay. 9639. 9639. Weapon upgrade kit and a golden pistol. Man, I really want that. I'll come back for it. I want to fabricate stuff first and then I'll come back for it because we have a lot of stuff to pick up. Seven one one four. Leah Macy. Shotgun shells. Oh, those were shotgun shell colors. Weapon upgrade, med kit fabrication, neuro mod, baseball glove. I hear something. You guys hear something? I hear something. Is that still coming from over there? It's still coming from over there. That place is creepy. Where the poltergeist was. Poltergeists are creepy. Um, honestly, I don't really know if we need a weapon upgrade kits. Um. We might have to upgrade our inventory again, to be honest. We're gonna get it so many, like, a lot more space whenever we do that, though. I'm, I'm literally just a hoarder, chat. I'm a big hoarder. I can't even, like, use these weapon upgrade kits on anything, because I have to... <sighs> okay, so my thought here is... My thoughts here are... We upgrade our inventory or or we can spec into either the glue gun or the shotgun. It's one or the other, to me at least. For like upgrades. Because the benefit of specking to the glue gun is that we also can upgrade the Q-beam. You know what I mean? Does that make sense? And the Q-beam might prove very useful to us. That is my thought there. And of course, there's always the option of saying screw it and just not doing either of those at all and only doing te uh, telepathy, or not telepathy, but neuro mods, right? Excuse me. I guess the glue gun then? That's what I'm thinking. I'm thinking we go with the glue gun, even though I do love the shotgun. Um, We'll just have to make more use of our, like, you know, these abilities that actually do other, that do damage and stuff. You know, you know what I mean? Does that make sense, Arena? Go with, like, lab tech. Yeah, sure, we'll do it. We can always make more anyways if we find enough if we find enough, uh, stuff. So we'll do lab tech, and then also, like, we'll do, uh... We'll do, like, energy stuff too, but... I'm gonna hold off on that. Um... Mainly because... I'll use it whenever we find the opportunity to. So now... We want to... Just go ham on upgrading stuff. Upgrade glue cannon, incapacitation rate. This should also save us on ammo, so we don't have to make too much ammo.
What is handling? Increased movement speed when firing? That could help us dodge stuff a lot, a lot easier. Blue cannon OP chat. And then I also want to upgrade this. So we'll do this. Um, firing time? Fire for longer between reloads. Reload speed. Fire for longer. Uh, handling, honestly, I think is good, but... I think either way, we're probably we're probably gonna be using it it against like big enemies, um, which usually have like AOE attacks. It seems like right, so I'm just gonna keep that there. What else could I use this for? I could probably use it for the stun gun, right? <clears throat> the disruptor stun gun. This might be a security thing, actually. Yeah, it's security. Okay, so I like this. So Q-beam upgraded, glue cannon upgraded. We have more spots since we use our weapon upgrades. Um, I think that's fine. I think that's good. I think that's all fine and dandy. I think it's all good. Instead of just using more inventory space, we do that instead. Now let's go get that golden gun. Also, who keeps hitting the stupid speaker thing? Chill. Alright, golden gun. Is it literally just like... The same as a silence pistol, but golden? Firepower 10. Firepower 10. A modified 8. A modified 10. Uh, what upgrades does it have? Firepower 10 to 12. I don't see a reason not to use this though. Excuse me. Uh, what is this? Gold plated trophy pistol once belonging to the four time world champion sports shooter Salith Rain. The champion visited Talos 1 to capture a connectum, a connectum of his brain in the Niramod division. During his visit, he was moved to present the pistol as a gift to, to Captain Jada Marks. Or Jada. Very cool though. I wonder if there's any difference. Like, why would you use a regular pistol over it? Is this unsilenced? Is that why? They both look like they have a silencer on the end. <clears throat> we can't get in there. We were able to open all of them except that one so far. Oh, shoot. Um, Psy abilities. Artemis is just a flat upgrade. That's what it looks like, right? That is crazy. Is he looking in this direction? It looks like he is. Hey, buddy! Electrostatic absorption available. That's not what I meant to do. I, I meant to pull out the golden pistol, but I forgot to set a... Uh, what is it? There we go. A hotkey for it. Dude, we got the 007 golden pistol now. Hell yeah. I didn't even get to use it. Does it sound different? No. Um, okay, Kelstrup. What is this? Eel prototypes? It didn't even break! Oh, god, that's gross! Ew. Ew. Hypo fabrication plan. Do we have that? 
A hypo? I'm pretty sure we have that already. Ew, why do they have so many of them? Why is it just laying all over your bed? What is this person? Are they like growing, growing eel meat on the shuttle or something? Is that their job? Yeah, that's what I can imagine, right? Email. Greetings, Dr. Kelshup. Unfortunately, we won't see another case of canned pears until the next supply shuttle arrives. As always, Elliot will mark them. EDS, thank you for your patience. Get them scheduled. Deja vu has said in again. Retracing steps is going to be a little harder this time. It seems that Mueller's staff was not properly recording data, so all the progress they made since the last apartment-wide removal is in jeopardy. We'll need to temper our, our expectations. Wiping the memories of the entire department is a tremendous setback, and I'm beginning to question... The practice versus the, the results we've seen. We should revisit the staggered system we discussed last year. Hans Kelstrup. Hans Kelstrup. Was there a... No, there wasn't a computer in here. Why does this guy don't have a computer? That's weird. Why no computer? I wonder if there's any way to get in here be besides morphing. Right? Well, I guess we'll find out when we go in it. Dio Igwe's cabin. Igwe. Error. Okay. It seems like there are only some places that you could only get into by hacking then, huh? Reactivator? Looks like a Neuromon. What does this do? A reactivator. Decreases the cooldown time. Oh, that's pretty good if you ask me. Yes, I am just going to make it so that we can put in more chips. More chat. More. More. More psi powers. More. I can't wait until we're like halfway through the game. We unlock uh, one more psi power and then our character just has a mental breakdown and dies or something. The process doesn't hurt not, uh, hurt not at all. Brandy Grace speaks happily. What is this? Neutral news? Neuromod donors? How would you know if it doesn't hurt at all if you don't remember it? Still have my love of skating, but the skill felt trapped inside my head. The mods, she corrects, the neuromods allow that skill to be shared with others. A gift. Give Cookie more game. More. More psi powers. More. Tammy's dot vodka. Orchestrated objective redu redu reduction? Consciousness of originates from processes inside neurons. Don't know what that means. Okay, well we have to find something to change into then, huh? Um... Yes, this will work. I pressed F to drop. There we go. That works. What? Oh, I ran out of side. Oh, I'm surprised there's nothing weird in here. Neural Horizon 2. Let's take this Psy Hypo test tube sample. Behind the Iron Curtain. Email. We should meet soon. Chief Yoshin. I work in psychotronics. We should meet soon. Somewhere private. You name the place and time and I will be there. Stay safe, Annalise. Chief Engineer Lucian. Your volunteer database access request has been denied on grounds of insufficient security clearance and lack of job relevance. Thank you for your understanding. Bianca Goodwin, volunteer. To Michaela Lucian, what is this to? To Michaela from... Okay. And we are CC'd in it. Door sensors and psychotronics. Sorry, I tried to go in and do what you asked, but they absolutely refused to grant entrance. They were also very rude and a little scary. They took the sensors and said they would install them. I don't know what else to say, I, so I gave up. Sorry. I have a special assignment for you today. I'm sending you down to Psychotronics with a kit of door sensor upgrades, and I want you to install them on every door on the deck. They may give you a hard time, but make sure they understand it's a safety issue. Let me know when the installations are complete, Michaela. That's an interesting way to spell Michaela. I don't think I've seen it spelled that way yet. So this is this is people um making neuromods, right? She nodded, not in agreement, but understanding my point, because they discovered they could map my brain, but I can't accept a neuromod myself. Her smile became firmer. I think that makes the gift more meaningful. 
For be a year before it was quietly decided by Transtar to receive no further neural maps, uh, connectomes from para paraplexic patients citing unspecified risks. Okay. Time to turn into a mug again. Oh, is there no way to get into that room? There's not a way from here, I don't think. No. What is in here then? Was that the other bathroom? Okay. Will Mitchell's cabin. So we're missing two keys so far. Huh? Why are those on? I didn't do that. <laughs> yeah, I didn't do that. That honestly was a lucky guess when I just randomly swung the wrench there. That was... I had no information going off that swing. <laughs> honestly, as much of a horror game as this was in the beginning, it's kind of... it's definitely opening up now. And it isn't feeling like so much of a horror. Because when something weird does happen now, it's like, oh, it's probably a poltergeist. It's just... it's just a Typhon. It's just a Typhon, don't worry about it. The real horror is me accidentally blowing myself up. Mm, I don't see a way in there. Looks like for some reason we can go across the top of this this rail thing. I wonder how much you can like truly stealth this. Like if you wanted to, could you really just jump up here and then... Oh my god. Oh my god, you actually could. If you really wanted to just pure stealth this, they give you the option to do weird stuff like this. My god. They're like, how many playstyles do we want to have in this game? All of them. <laughs> Why do I hear something in there? We were in there already. Abigail's cabin. Wait, what do we... Did I miss something in here? What would I have missed in here, chat? What do we have Abigail's cabin marked? Is it because of this? At this point, I might just, just like spec one point in the hacking, to be honest. We don't have the password for this. Screw it. I don't know where I don't know where we would get the pa the password because I'm pretty sure we found their body, didn't we? You always miss something, right? There's too much stuff in this game, man. Uh, let's just it's, it's only one, so I mean, like, sure, we'll get it. Oh god, what if we mess this up, does it screw us over? The hacking skill allows you to bypass security systems, protecting keypads, workspace, uh, workstations, and security stations. Higher skill levels, you can hack into robotic systems such as turrets and operators. Use WSAD to quickly navigate the best stream to reach the target. Once inside the target, press the prompt button to complete the hack. Oh, where am I? Oh. X? Easy. First try, chat. First try. Wasn't, wasn't sweating at all as there were like two seconds left. Oh my god. Oh, we can probably guess the last number. Bolt caster ammunition. Uh, so I'm assuming this is going to be to fabricate it, right? 
Conversation archive, archive the melodrama is real. Bullshit, I'm sorry's with no resolution. Between him and Morgan, it's like a tradition. You family sorry. Was oh, it dang. as insincere as a Danielle show apology? No. Danielle, I'm not saying working with them is easy, but did you just compare me to him? To that arrogant sack of shit? Danielle, this has to stop. You're right. Get out. We're done. Danielle, oh shit! Get out. Well that didn't last long. <laughs> Oh, yeah, that didn't last long, huh? They tried. I don't think this is a drill. Did you feel the vibration? Felt like a blast on the lower decks. Are you okay? I heard some people were hurt. Please be there, please. Come find me. I tried calling Emma at the fitness center. Something seriously wrong there. Get out, get out of crew, and I'll come find you. Read treasure hunt. You're such a nerd, Abigail. Greetings, adventure. Oh, yeah, this is. Oh, yeah. Okay. That's her reply. Um. So, let's see. Uh. Do we have. Notes. Wait, no. We want, like, uh. Is there a way to see. Is it. No, it's not in plans. See those notes again? It's gonna have to be in notes, right? Like, that's, that's what it has to be. Yeah, okay. Uh, I'm assuming that's when she was stuck in the thing, right? Mel Melindra Shadow. Corner. First game. Okay, treasure maps. Oh, no. Are they all spread out? B2. L2. Why, why is there an L? B2, L2. We still don't have show's treasure map. L1. What? What does L and B stand for? Maybe like, uh, maybe it's not the numbers, but maybe you're supposed to look at something on the wall. Maybe you look at something on the wall in these areas? Otherwise, why else would it have like an eye pointing at something? My problem is like, I just don't... Is there a way to easily tell where they're at? Like, where the heck is this? Where's this pog face at, dude? Like, where, where even would that be? Is there anything even here that would resemble that? Maybe, probably not in this, not in the crew area though, right? It has to be like spread out in the, no. It had to have been a place that everyone has access to, right? Oh, can I not like check individual maps? Oh no. Oh no. I don't think I can check individual maps. We still haven't been to the cafeteria yet, though. But that's still odd. Maybe we'll just wait until we find the last map. I don't know. What if we're just like... Oh. Okay, never mind. Let's, let's, let's figure it out later. We'll wait until we find Daniel Show's map. Uh, did we find the body for Daniel's show before? You're supposed to find the corresponding place on the map and look. Oh, uh, that sucks. That really do suck. Let's see. I'm pretty sure we found Daniel's show or Danielle's show before. Oh god, I don't remember where she's part of. I'm surprised we didn't find it in, like, any of the rooms. I totally forgot, like, what- where- what she could have been, to be honest. D2, 
deep storage. Nominal. Wait, she's still alive? What? No, she's not alive because that's... Yeah, that's her freaking... That's her tracking device, right? That she took off. So, I don't know where her actual body is. Oh, shoot. Well, that sucks. I don't even think this is... Yeah, this is her cabin. She took her thing off. We don't know where the heck she is. Her thing's not in here, so we don't know where her map is. Actually, will this show us where it is? Randomly? Treasure hunt. Find Daniel Show's map. Oh god. Oh god, where the hell would we find that? Unless, like, Abigail has it? Search the security station for foul surveillance on... Okay, there's a lot of stuff to do here. Where did she work? She worked in the, uh... What the heck was it? Deep storage. So... I guess she probably could be. Her body could be in deep storage. She brought the treasure map with her to deep storage. <laughs> So I'm pretty sure that's where it was, right? We went to deep storage and it was there. Yeah, there it is. But we have to get recordings. We still need more recordings as well. Um, For all we know, we might still... We might even still have a... Hold on. For all I know, we might have recordings that we haven't listened to yet. I'm just going to scroll through this and see if there's any that are not checked off. It looks like they're all checked off. Oh god, oh god, oh god. So maybe- so we still need to find recordings then, huh? Let's- let's go check out what's in here. I'm sure there could be- I'm sure there's recordings around here. Just around. Wait, but why is the yellow tulip- Dude, I don't even know what side quest we have or something. Are these- because there's- wasn't there an audio log in the theater? Fuck. Why are these lit up? There's there there's a quest we're tracking that's lighting these up. Search the theater and the yellow tool. Okay. Um, where the hell are we gonna find that? I thought I was pretty thorough in my search. Maybe I wasn't thorough. Well, we didn't have that quest before we came here, so I didn't just, like, open up all these theater chairs. Which it is not in. And that is not looking glass, that's a projector. Excuse me. Watch it be stuck in one of the seats. That's where it has to be, right? It's under one of them. So, I found your sticky note. The one under the desk, with your password. Wait, you were under my desk? Look, you need to keep your password safe, oh, well, right? There went that I one Nero mod. Because <laughs> I love you. You love me? I love you enough to crawl under your desk. I totally wasn't looking for the pen I dropped. What does that even mean? Flatter. Love you enough to crawl under your desk? That has nothing even related to it. Uh, so there's one in the yellow tool up here somewhere, right? Where the heck? If I was a hidden audio log, where would I be, chat? Um, oh yeah, that's right. We turned the, we turned the old stuff on here, so this works. Um... Session playback. Welcome, everyone. We've made an amazing achievement. Is this stand-up comedy? 12 hours ago, we have broken the 8,000 neural mod mark. 8,000 neural mods. Sharing skills. Abilities. That's a lot of neural mods. Improving the quality of life. And you are to be congratulated. You are the ones who made this all possible. 
And congratulations to my dear brother, Morgan, who is left for Earth size to assist in Oh, Alex is toast. Like he's toasting. Like celebration toast. The Transstar. Bro, it's not what I was thinking of. It's definitely not what I was thinking of. <laughs> what is success if it can't be Tizzy. Let no, me introduce Tizzy. a few of our employees. Supply closet. None of which had any musical talents until yesterday. Except Chief Show, who I'm told has a lovely singing voice. Sky, Danielle, whenever you ladies are ready. Jesus Christ, what happened in here? Oh my God. Don't lock yourself in the supply closet. What's that noise? Spare parts. We got all this moonshine. They had all this stuff in here, dude. I don't know why they didn't just drink like crazy. Brandy Pester. Not pestering anyone anymore. Jenny Garbensoff. Well. More like Jenny Garbensoff herself. Well, that's pretty bad. No. The escape pods didn't work and we believe it was intentional. Those black shapes are everywhere and everyone we, we know is dead. Or something worse. We aren't going to let that happen to us. To our families. We love you. Rip. What's his face? Alex probably turned all the escape dropships off, huh? It had to have been him. He just said, nothing escapes. And then they turned it off. To be honest, like, what do you expect to happen? If you're in a situation like this, I feel like, uh, if you're doing, like, top secret work or something like that, and you have escape pods, bro, just, just cut it off now. You know you're not going to escape. And the reason why is because they can't let, like, some strange creature or experiment get out to the rest of the world, right? So, if you're working here, bro, don't expect to leave. If you're working anywhere like this, don't expect to leave. That's the real thing. Right? Does, does that make sense? The higher-ups... The only people who are going to, to live are the people who are in on it, 100%. The people who know. That's how it always seems, though. That has to be like a, a techno... Technomancer, whatever the heck they are, right? That has to 100% be a Technomancer. The golden gun is there. I was like, where the heck did I put it? More! More! Technopath, yeah. Technopath. More! Yeah, there's a- there's- isn't there a third floor? Yeah, so we gotta take the elevator to the third floor. That's not good. Uh, so what do we need to do? I'm pretty sure maybe we play the recorder for... ...this. And this should be it. Oh, fuck! I should have expected this. I don't know why I didn't expect this. No! Oh. Ow. The few when pausing streamer keeps pausing game streamer. Streamers are pausing in. I'm kidding. <laughs> Shoot. 
You've been waiting for me to play semi sacred geometry. Is that what that song was? to spoof the lock on deep storage anyway. Also, I've been monitoring noetic field signatures around the station when I can. With humans, the signal barely registers. The Typhon make a strong ripple. I honestly expected a nightmare. But with the coral, my instrument readings are coral erratic. Wait, with the coral, what it means. The sooner we get your arming key, the better. Oh, I should. Is this the armored core DLC? I said the signal barely registers on humans, but when I scan you, it's on the level of a Typhon. I wonder why. C couldn't couldn't be because I just I don't know pumped myself full of Nero mods, would it? Nah, it couldn't be. Unhealthily pumping myself with Nero mods. Nah, I think we're fine. Don't worry about it. There's nothing to worry about. What's gonna happen? We're gonna escape. We're gonna go crazy and then start blowing stuff up. Nah, don't worry about that, genuine. Exactly. It's just a... It's just a Neuromod addiction speaking. Like, don't worry about it. Cool. Yeah, but but don't don't worry about it, January. It's just the uh oh my god, what my scroll wheel is going crazy. That's not what I meant to do. Well, it's dead now. Yeah, don't worry about it, January. It's just it's I'm I love Nero mods. I mean what? Oh boy, I love Nero mods. Just turn into a Nero tuber at this point. Oh, that's not very good. Welcome, Morgan Yu. Dinner menu. Oyster omelette with Jamon, Jamon, Jamon or Jamon tomatoes. Char grilled siskak eel in lemongrass and turmeric. Excuse me, ma madalote. Madalote? What the hell is that? In a seasoned wine sauce. Moonshade lemon capellini. Cap, cap. With a cetra caviar, pasta with beans, and lightly fried sunburst bananas. Dude, being here, eating here must have been the best, dude. Oh my god. Joseph McSorley, well, he's definitely going to feel very McSor after that. Or he's going to feel very McSorley after that. Did that guy die eventually? Like, what's going on here? Or did I just wait too long so he died? What? 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 Yeah, Mine Jack 3 available. Alright. If he notices me, I'm sure the other ones notice too, right? It's probably just how it works. The only thing he can do though is probably just like send dudes over from a far range. Whoever you are, run. There is no more fool here except you. If you are still a hold of your brain, good. Others here? Or not? Shoot first before they get close. Their pockets! Bombs. Bombs. Their master is close. Kill this or puppets or both. But do it before. But do it before they kill you. They kill you. No All right. Or puppets. Maybe we talk. I like how I hit him with the uh, thing. Ma Ma Madelote is like a French fish stew. That actually kind of sounds good. That sounds really good. What happened to that mind jack guy that was over here? There was a... There was a dude over here, right? Must have just walked out wherever.
I don't see any mind controlled people up here, so this is good. Uh, that would have been great to get him there. Considering all we ever see is eel scrap, it's probably made with eels. Ah, uh, yes, the fish is only eels, true. Oh, he's like leading his shots. Cool. Kill a few of your puppets. Now you join them. You. Come to kitchen window. Let me see you. I'm glad there's a lot of people that are only unconscious. It's kind of weird though, like, I wonder... <laughs> oh, what? Excuse me? Aside from the few you didn't save, right? Aside from the few... <laughs> this dude's head is sticking out of the table! What? <laughs> How do- how do you even end up like this? Can I pull him out? Oh god. <laughs> oh my god. That poor guy. Oh, it's like a buffet. Oh my god. Bro, I'm getting so hungry. This makes me hungry as heck. Oh my god. Oh my god, there's so much food, dude. This would have been amazing. I don't know why these people always complain here. Oh, I don't get the window seat. Oh, I don't get the window seat in my room. No. Like, what even? Oh, shit. What the hell happened in here? Kitchen access. We gotta go to the window for that, but I'm just still just looking around. I don't get the window seat in my room, but everyone cooks for me and stuff. You get added. It looks like adequate time to do whatever you want and play D and D. Of course, there's a trans star advertisement outside this window. Cade Mason. Well, so much for that guy. Holy shit, this guy's actually alive. Uh, your suit. What is in your name tab? You? Um, am you? Am you. You killed this yourself. Ah. He doesn't even know who if we you are. Want to come in, be safe. You go. Get something of mine, huh? I mean, here, I'm fine out here, here, but... It opens my room. Go there. Get my award. It's important to me. Okay. Then maybe we talk. Okay. I mean, to be honest, the Typhon should probably be trying to get in there rather than uh, rather than me. I think uh, we're a lot scarier to the Typhons than uh, we than uh, they are to us. At least now. Is there anything behind all of this? No? Okay, well. Is there anything behind the desk? Nope. Well, let's go over to his cabin and see what's uh, important over there. We still haven't even gone all the way up. You. Mr. You. Don't worry about power flickering. Station is just hurting. Keep going. You're not stuck on Talos 1 with them, they're stuck on Talos 1 with you? True. Exactly. At first we were stuck on Talos 1 with them. But now that... <laughs> now now that he's just like, So anyways, I'm gonna put in all the Nero mods and have Nero mod addiction. Run around, just blow everything up. Yeah, I would say now uh, they're stuck on here with uh, with you. With Mista, you. The Transglutaminus. Minase? Mines? Tigur Tigase. Tigus? Tigase? 
A naturally occurring enzyme found in plants, animals, and bacteria, TG is often, often used to bond protein-containing foods together and in the production of foods such as imitation crab meat and fish balls, known colloquially as, or by chefs as meat glue. Ah, yes. Is, uh, isn't this like a... Isn't this the stuff when, like, you cook a, a burger or something? Isn't that the red stuff? That, like, comes out. It's not actually blood, but it's... Maybe it's, like, some type of thing. Gluing chicken skin to sa salmon will actually protect the outside of the salmon from overcooking. What the hell? Will Mitchell. Maybe I'm thinking of something else. Sounds like an anti-waffle commercial. Well... I didn't see it as an no override per se. It was just the operator's conversation sequencer. They're usually so grim. <sighs> Do you know how many security protocols you broke? Well, Morgan said it was all right. Even helped me. I'm Operator Skillet, Miss Show. My, you sound like you could use a healthy dose of sunburst banana party. <clears throat> this is an A-B conversation, Skillet. Apologies, Chef. I'll see my way out. Before I hack it, I'm gonna give the thing to him. Yeah, be before I hack it, I'm gonna give the thing to him. I don't know if, like, you fail the hack, you can't do it anymore or what, so... I don't want to find out. <clears throat> also... That guy was way skinnier than he, sh than he looks in here. What if MU comes back? Let him you in, but... Oh no. Don't tell me he's gonna find turn or something. You back? Come to window. Show me. This guy has become... This guy has become... Caveman. I don't know if it's because of the Nero mods. Or what. Either that, or he's just been stuck in here for so long. Uh, did he have glasses in the... In the the voice mod thing? Maybe he just ate a lot of food, you know? You found something? Huh. You know, being stuck in a kitchen, I would just binge eat. I promised. Go around. The side entrance. Like, I'm gonna die by Typhons and everything, right? You might as well. Just make food and eat everything you can. Just survive, you know? Eat Wait. that good shit. A minute. <clears throat> Wait a second. There's blood in here. He's locking us. Oh wait, no, he didn't lock us in here. Okay. I thought he was going to cannibalize us for a second. He could just like be bur butchering normal meat, so. You're safe now. The beasts, they cannot get in. But. Look at this. We have food, but no water. This pressure glitter. It is broken. System automatic cut off until fixed. You can find a replacement part in greenhouse, I think. With water, we can wait for rescue. No water? Huh. Do this favor, I'll let you into freezer. That's where I hid all the puppets the beast sent first. Maybe they have useful things for you, no? Um, so I didn't need to repair that there. Because we already had three on us from earlier. You fix? Mm, smart one. Hey, I have a feeling he's going to be eating the puppets. Like Lots of dead puppets and supplies. I hope he's not eating them. Maybe, wait, wait. So, has he been letting them in here and then they pop? It is all that is between us and beasts. Okay, okay, okay. Bro, he's, he's eating the dead puppets, is he? When puppets can get in, explode like bombs. The beast lays eggs in their head, make them explode. Oh, okay, I see. It all makes sense now. Um... Well, that's cool. Take whatever you want. Only leave puppets for me. 
Only leave puppets for me. Oh, God. I already hear this name before. No, you don't. No, 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 don't know what you're talking about. MU, don't know who MU is. Quiet now. I don't like using this fabricator in his in his freaking domain, dude. Don't mind me. Useful things for you, or maybe inside is another way out. Oh, safe in here. M, you know you, right? If you're hungry, eat. I have a feeling he's gonna like try and trap us in the freezer. That has to be like one of the outcomes of this, right? He just traps us in the freezer. Oh yes, we have so many more ones now. There's no way he doesn't try to trap us. Cause he's talking too much. No black swimming. At least there's eel scraps. Others come. Try to a human. Get me to open the door. Listen, dude, you need to stop talking. I'm just looking around you real quick, like chill. Bro, that is so scuffed. <laughs> Bro, there's there's no way he doesn't like try to eat us or something, right? I already hear this name before. You can't tell me I didn't expect that, right? Are you awake, am you? Frozen dead, maybe? I take Puppet's toy screen. I see all the names in the list. Your name too means you listen. What's this? Excerpt from a book on healthy cooking. Yeah, yeah, hold on, Will. I need to see about cooking with cauliflower real quick. We're known for its versatility and lush aroma. I actually like cauliflower chat. Cauliflower can be substituted in many traditional recipes to boost our nutrient payload without compromising on flavor. Fox mashed potatoes, pizza crust, cauliflower, cauli fried rice. I love that so much. Cauli fried rice pellets and much more. Or and more. But if you're looking to maximize health benefits of this dimpled delicacy, then steaming is your best bet. Go for the purple variety if you really want to add a blast of color to your plate. Dude, I love From cauliflower. On, I know. Will Mitchell tracking bracelet. Like you try to feed me to them, or cold kills you first, make you into a frozen puppet. That guy's not William Mitchell, chat. This guy isn't Mitchell. I don't think that guy's Mitchell. I mean, he was too big to look to to be William Mitchell, and we knew that when we saw the recorder. That was that was pretty clear to see. Uh, when he started talking and it didn't look like him, then wasn't it obvious from the transcribe? Yeah, right? When we started talking and it didn't look like him and he didn't look like he was a big guy, it's kind of sus. But I wonder who he is then. Ice blockage? Uh, Abigail Foy. Bro, she's in here? What the fuck? Holy shit, I was not expecting that. Someone just started cannibaling people even before like this stuff even went off? What the hell is that? Neuromods, jellied eels, take the ammo for the Q-beam. 
I got all this stuff. What is this? Mech tech? Reduce the time it takes to repair an object. Yeah. That is friggin' wild, dude. This dude... Literally... We don't even know who he is. That feel when you're... Gay but a cannibal gets your girlfriend first? True! Oh my god. Rip, dude. Rip. Okay, well, the only way to get through here is... To get the ice blockage out of the way. And... Well, we can't really move it, but anytime now. A anytime now, you know. I like how it breaks the block instead of melting it. It just breaks in the pieces. <laughs> that is kind of funny. Oh, I would imagine with this part, you'd probably have oxygen, right? So you'd probably be like time to figure this out. Well, rip Abigail, dude. That's kind of scuffed. Imagine just having to use heat forehead. Imagine not just moving the block with sure manliness, you know? Is he gonna be mean? I, I think he's gonna- I think he's gonna be like, Whoa, how'd you get out? Whoa! I lived, bitch. Wait, where the hell did he go? Where did he go? This is, wait, 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 where, where would he go? Like, he trapped us in there and then he just left? Wasn't he like, deathly afraid of leaving or something like that? What? Recycler charge trap? Why- why can you use it? Let's disarm. Manual override. Yeah, I mean, it was right there under the button. <laughs> Four jellied eels, two pacific sliders, three siskak unagi rolls. Order for Quentin. She just mentioned Quentin when we picked up the note. That's funny. I lived, bitch! Where'd you go? Where you at? I guess it makes sense that he moves if they want you to be able to use the, the recycler and the, uh, what is it called? The, uh... Why is this guy highlighted? He mentioned you were smart since you fixed the water regulator. Maybe he figured you'd be smart enough to escape so made an early exit. Yeah, you know, that's valid. He acknowledged how smart we were. He didn't, he didn't, uh, you know, overjudge us, I, I guess. Choices you don't think matter, matter. Oh, true, true. Crew. Well, clearly this guy's not Will, right? Is he Quentin? We don't- we don't know anyone that looks like him, at least he- he hasn't like talked- He hasn't had a name to match him. Is he someone that lives in the crew quarters? 
Guest World Cup MVP. Do we have anything on Argentino Pero? This is like the only person we haven't seen yet in here. He's definitely not Will. Have we even found Will? Will Mitchell. Oh yeah, yeah. He it was this tracking thing in the in the what what was it called? It was this tracking thing in the in the meat pile. Um, I know this isn't the way to follow this guy, but I'm pretty sure we got that thing from Abigail that was like tap on the fitness center window or something like that. I'll hear you. So maybe that's where her dead body is or something. You found Will? Yeah, the tracking dude in the meat pile. Holy shit, she's alive! How long has she been out here? Morgan? If you're here, then... Abby didn't make it, did she? Yeah, do you have the treasure piece? The last treasure map? Nothing more that I can do for you right now. But, look, be careful. You're freaking There's wild for being out there. crew quarters pretending to be the cook. Yeah? Really? His tracking bracelet's from Psychotronics, but... Psychotronics. The ID doesn't make any sense. He... I think he's the one that killed Abby. Uh, yeah, we saw Abby if dead in can, there. Make sure he doesn't get off the station. I'll see what else I can do to help from out here. For as long as I can. Goodbye, Morgan. Um... You might be able to go to other places, you know. Was she just, like, hiding there the whole time? Restore from backup. So she said he was from Psychotronics, but his ID didn't match anything? Use samples of Daniel Show's voice to enter deep storage. Yeah, we can go to deep storage now. Kill the imposter. They're really just like, kill him. Well done, finding Chief Show. You've got what you need to get into deep storage. Okay, thank you. So it's someone from Psychotronics. It would be someone who's nominal, right? Let's just take a look real quick. Igwe? It's not what... Trevor J. Young? Could it be Igwe? There's no way it's Igwe, right? Igwe had a had a a room, right? I think his room was on the other side. I'm pretty sure Igwe had a room and I don't think he if I remember what Igwe might have looked like, I don't think it would look like him at all. Igwe. Oh actually, you know what? Maybe it is him. Bro, I swear he had a room. Did he not? Maybe it was on the other side. What the heck? Am I going crazy? D Igwe. Oh my god. Yeah, it was on the right side. Okay, dude. Hmm. There's nothing in here that really would equate to it being him unless we hack this, but we can't hack it, so... Huh. Orchestrated objective redu reduction. I don't... I, I don't think it's Igwe. It might be. Why the heck did he... Wait, wait, wait. Why did he want that trophy? Oh, no. What could the trophy have had? Wait, so he wanted the trophy from Will Mitchell. He had the thing to Will Mitchell. Why? What? Why? 
Sorry to contact you during your downtime, but Alex has been working through a uh, four shift to put you a request to grab shaft as A088. We already knew that. I think we already knew that. Morgan, you will which emote upgrade. Just the cafeteria mit, uh, visits or taking food in your quarters now, but I wanted to say thanks for the again for the emote upgrade. You should hear Skillet now much better. Don't think Danielle liked it, so hopefully that doesn't cause any trouble between you two. Don't be a stranger. There's still plenty of your favorite snacks in stock. Just swing whenever you get a breather. Uh, none of this was helpful, was it? Besides the code, if you didn't already have it. Huh. What was that guy's name? Quentin? Have we found Quentin? Uh, that would be way too many names to look for it. I'm assuming it's going to be a last name too, right? I'm pretty sure we saw a uh, Quentin around here though. Other than it seems like Will was a good friend of Morgan's, right? From from that, it definitely looks like it. So you're taking the, the stuff in the, the thing now? So like, he would have remembered us, right? There's no way he could have forgotten unless something, some weird shit. Making show's revenge quest more personal? True. True. So, it's like, what I'm thinking is... Trevor J. Young. That guy does not look like a Trevor. Does he look like a Trevor? Does his... Does his accent sound like a Trevor? I don't think so. So, now the other problem is... Is we can't really trust when it says there's no life signs. Like, we can't trust that because they, they could have taken their tracker off. Would she say his ID doesn't make sense if it appears on the sec roster? I... I guess, right? His ID doesn't make any sense. How... So she knows he's from... Psych, right? And he says his ID doesn't make sense. So would it be like... Would an ID be a name? ID doesn't make sense. I guess I guess it wouldn't show up, right? We don't have to like find this out now, but... Wait, there's a guy that's alive in the Talos 1 lobby? What? We've... How is there a guy in the Talos 1 lobby? Oh, what if he- what if he has an ID? What if he has someone else's- oh, he probably has someone else's- There was a man locked in a room, remember? Oh, was that the- that was the, uh, yeah, that was the mind-controlled guy, huh? Yeah, you're right. You're right. <clears throat> Was there was there a mind controlled guy in Cargo Bay? Oh wait, no. He's a Neuromod researcher. Cargo Bay we haven't gone to yet. Right. It, it probably one probably doesn't even show up in here. Probably I'm going to assume it probably doesn't show up in here. And if it the I she said to say anything about the life sense. So if anything I would think it's Igwe, or it's just not showing up in, on the Psychotronics. Or, or it just like doesn't show at all. There was another guy you met in Psychotronics? Wasn't that the... That was the guy we saved though, right? Whose name does not appear in the roster. That was probably, uh... What was it? The guy we killed, right? Was it that guy? Because he was a, a volunteer. So could this guy also be like a psychotronics volunteer? Quote volunteer? That would I guess that would make sense, right? Don't tell me he had a recycler bomb on that and I just didn't notice it. There was probably a recycler bomb on it, wasn't there?
Yep. Okay. <laughs> I'm gonna have to watch everything, huh? <laughs> God dang it. Pursuant to AU's orders, I have compiled a report concerning Annalise Gallegos or Ga Gallegos and associates. Enclosed is a suspicious conversation. Rip Morgan, now just a ball of organic material. No one will ever remember him. Wait, why is there a one here? Is that because we're... Is that because we're we're tracking someone right now? Maybe that's probably what it is, right? That has to be it. Uh, sure. Let's let's see the recording. I got the container set up. This is pretty weird, Quentin. I know, but if we, I don't want to know. I'm doing this as a favor. That's all. Cargo container three two three two. It's on the other side of cargo. Hey, it's definitely not Quentin. Next to the utility tunnel. When I was head chef at the Space Institute, no one asked me to conceal food in a cargo container. Just go easy on the eel, alright? Wait, so is he smuggling more food? Um... Okay. Search the bay for something like he intended. Subject left private quarters. Return. Observing, observe subjects quarters. Admitted to the kitchen. Took meal into his room. Wait, what? What if this guy is just like smuggling food? It, it's way less interesting than Alex Yu thinks it is. He's he's just he just wants more sushi. He's just smuggling extra food. Right? That's what I would think. Uh so we have something to do in the arboretum. We still need to find Daniel Show's map. It's not in her room. Uh we didn't ask her for it before she left. Uh <clears throat> That's in the cargo bay, so Excuse me. Damn, we still need to go to a deep storage in the cargo bay, right? Have we been to the cargo bay before, actually? Oh shit, it's 12 o'clock. Sorry, past 12. Um, if I look at it, I'll probably remember. No, we haven't gone to the cargo bay yet. Okay. I don't know why we have this guy highlighted. Is it because I accidentally scanned him, so now he's just going to pop up every time? No, more storage space would be nice. I don't think we have a use for these anymore, though. Because we already used the water pressure regulator. Um, That guy definitely has to be a volunteer. Just thinking about it. Huh. Alex Yu, he doesn't, he think he's, he's heard of someone named Alex Yu. So yeah, he definitely has to be like a volunteer or something. You even notice those disruptor batteries were there. Quote, volunteer. Um, well, if anything, he knows how to make... Recycling grenade traps, so that's something. I'm surprised this body does, doesn't just like float up. We know the code to the executive suites. There's a technopath here? That's... <laughs> that's kind of concerning. Since it's 12 o'clock, I'm gonna do this executive suites part and then I'll probably call it after this. Alright. Morgan Yu. Hey, this is our suite. There's a technopath in here. Guest suite. Nicole Hag. 
for Hague. Now oh, there's two of them in there. They they know I'm here. Oh, they're kind of strong. Um, okay, I guess they weren't that strong. Nicole Haig. Wedding ring! Oh, that's the... That's the... Isn't this the, uh, what, what the heck is it? Was that the the girl who played D&D, &D, right? And Ar Argenteno Pero. Well, he Argenteno perished. <laughs> yeah. This was the people that were on, like, their weird honeymoon or something, right? The, isn't this the one that has the quest of looking at the tree? They're gonna be like, we're gonna do it in the executive suites. <laughs> or some bullshit. In the executive guest suite. What is, what is this, a shower? What is this? Am I, am I supposed to be able to see through that or not? That is odd. Huh. Shower shower glass strong as hell though. Think that sink's missing a texture? Yeah, I think it's missing a texture too. That was pretty odd. Cigar. Uh oh, I was expecting to find something sus in the nightstands to be honest. I don't see anything in here. Alex, you. We need our brother's key card, which we would probably get if we went to his, to his uh suite or his like thing in the middle there. Wait, he booby trapped this, the the elevator, and then left. Unless he's hiding in Alex's thing. I'm be honest, he looks like Alex. What if that is Alex? It's just his double personality. <laughs> so now he's hiding in his own his own room. <laughs> he messed up his mission. He forgot. He booby trapped the bottom. Yeah, but you would booby trap the bottom. Oh, I guess that's true. You possibly booby trapped the bottom so you couldn't go up, or he booby trapped the bottom so if you came down it explodes. If he doesn't like the use. Neuromod fabrication plan. Yeah, a paradox. Or, you know, you can just hack your own computer if for some reason you wanted to do that. This does look exactly like our suite. It looks so similar, it's kind of scary. There's no closet there either. It looks so similar to the, uh, you know, the simulation, because obviously, you know, obvious reasons. Oh, I guess that makes sense what that noise is now. That noise is the Technopath chilling on the other side of the door. Was there a point of coming here? I mean, I guess there's nothing we would hide from ourselves, right? So... Yeah, so I guess- I guess I don't really- Oh, what's this? Psychoshock amp? We already have one of these, don't we? Oh, I guess we don't. But we can definitely use it because we use Psychoshock. We don't use electromagnetic burst. We use psycho shock. Damn, the U's look kind of badass. I'm not gonna lie. Do we not have like a secret anything here? I guess not. We don't really have any weird secret stuff guess. This looks great though. 
That's kind of shaking. That was weird. Oh, you can only lean when you stop moving. I see. Hmm. That's weird because that simulation was so scuffed that we walked out and then we would turn left and like all there is is a chair. There's just a, a, a sofa chair. And it's not like an apartment building or something. That freaking noise of the, st the stupid, uh... Lock? That's cool that you can, like, also lock them and everything. So that guy hauled ass out of here. What the fudge is... Why is that floating? That's not a, uh... I don't think it's a mimic. Doesn't look like one. It's just a floating person. Okay, did we do everything here? Um, I think... I think we did do everything here, huh? We can finally leave this place. Jesus. I like how it was... how I said... Or how my, um, what is it? My, my stream title is like, Can we finally, uh, do anything in the main story? Uh, I guess we did accomplish getting the, the, the voice. Um, to enter deep storage. But dang, was that long. Oh wait, it looks like uh, wait, we knew Alex attacked December. Wait, if we know that Alex actually definitively attacked December. Huh. But also, January doesn't know anything about December. That's kind of weird. Didn't January be like, oh, it's an imposter or something? Only trust me. Find the tree with the lover's initials in the Arboretum. Search cargo bay for the secret crate. Find Daniel Show's map, which we still have not found. I guess we won't find it until she dies and then we can loot her body, right? Okay. I think what I'll do is I'll probably end it there. That was the whole entire crew quarters. We'll probably be back because we're still missing a... Or it might be where she works. Oh yeah, that's right in the uh the deep the deep place, right? The deep deep place. Wait, wasn't it like uh she actually made it, right? She showed up, but there was the one note that was like, uh, I have a spare character sheet on me. If you weren't able to go home in time, right? Well, or go home to go to your crew thing in time, right? I did not mean to quick press that. So, so it was what? So, apparently, um, she went, she wasn't able to make it back to her room before showing up to D&D, &D, right? So if she wasn't able to make it back to her room before showing up to D&D, &D, she could have left work in a hurry. So she also could have left the, the treasure thing there too, as well. At least that's what I would imagine, right? So, yeah, it definitely could be where she worked, like, some office or type thing or something like that. I'm not gonna lie, dude. Working on Talos, Talos 1? Oh, bro. Working on Talos 1 seems amazing. Besides the part where, you know, the Typhon uh, break free and want to kill you. Break free or... Oh, shit. 
Maximum amount of saves. Oops, well, you know. You know how I save. Uh, broke free or started to come to the station to save their, you know, their peoples. I'm gonna call it there, though. We streamed three hours today. I don't want to be streaming forever, so I'll call it there. Thank you for coming. Oh my god. Dude, today's stream, what the heck did we even do? We just did, like, the Arboretum. We, uh, did some of the hardware. Wait, where we go? We went to, like, the hardware place? No. What the f Fudge! Hey, 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 hey! Hey! Why are you corrupted? Why are there another one up there corrupted? Why are there three corrupted? There has to be like a techno path here, right? That'll be something for future Cookie to remember. <laughs> there is a techno path here. Uh, good luck, future Cookie. I hope you remember that. Um, anyways, I head out now. Have a good night. I go. I'll probably make food. Yeah, that's probably what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna make food. Have a good night. Bye bye. Uh, what what did what do people say? Oh, well, like subscribe. Bro, this, this video is way too long. No one's even gonna, like, sit through all of it to like and subscribe, okay? But anyways, have a good night, and bye-bye, 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 bye-bye. Jesus. I'm hungry.